Let's see. Well, thank you, Drameka, for resubbing. Um, I... So, guys. Uh, there's no Badgie today. Badgie is otherwise indisposed. Uh, he's got... He's got stuff on. Hi! It's just me today, unfortunately. Badgie is away. <laughs> Uh, we're still gonna, I'm still gonna do some food reacts and stuff for y'all, but now we don't get to be harassed by the badger. So, no badger jump scares today, guys. <laughs> hi, hi! Yeah, it's just gonna be you and me today. Uh, aww. Thanks, Miz. But yeah, don't worry. The trash doesn't stop just because Badgie, Badgie can't be here. So we're going to do stuff. I'm going to drink my coffee that's probably cold. Yes. The goal, uh, the sub goal is still running. Uh, if we hit it today, it just means that the next stream where he's here, we make him do it. So, <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, thanks for gifting a sub. And that put, apparently put us on a hype train already. <laughs> um, yeah, Miz is off to a head start. I know Boulder sent a few in uh, last weekend, even though we couldn't stream. So I'd like to thank Boulder, even if they're not here right now. Oh my god, <laughs> Miz, thank you. Yeah, I, I don't have a mod in here right now, I'm pretty sure. Um, so I'm running, I'm running this on my own and I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I really should open Twitch as well. So that I can get a... Um, so... I can figure out how to do polls and stuff. You would think I would learn this. You'll eat the butt. Mmm, <laughs> tastes like metal. Yum yum. Uh, so thank you, Miz, again for gifting those five subs. We will get there. We will get the badgie to eat the jarlic. It'll be great if we can do it before, like... Oh... Dramaka, I haven't even started here. I, you know what? I'm probably just gonna record the whole thing. Um, thank you, Dramaka, for the ten subs. Hi, hi, Zane. Uh, Christ. <laughs> new friend, new follower. Oh, thank you. Hi. Hello, Wolf Kissed Gentleman. How are you? Hastafo, hey. Um, I can see here that our favorite not sure what's cooking lady has, I think that's pasta with a uh, carrot or something by the look of the thumb. Oh, good, my. Uh, Elric, can you not mess with the ring light, please? Oh, and now Elric is behind, so if the camera shakes, that's because Elric decided he wanted to climb behind the computer. Celtic Wolfbane. That's pretty na That's a pretty cool name. Elric is, uh, yeah, Elric's here. Uh, oi. Elric. Here's the buddy. Yeah. Oh, you saying hi to everybody? He's being a dick, aren't you? Are you being a little shit? For anyone not familiar, this guy is the cause of many, 
many an angry, angry yell because you mess with everything, don't you? So I, oh, I'm, now I'm going to spend the entire stream covered in cat hair. So why did I wear black? Uh, okay, look, let me just try and get comfortable with you on my lap because you're so big. No, that's my mic. <laughs> Please. Oh, and now he's licking me. Excellent. All right. So the bot, while the bot catches up with uh, all of the subs that Dromeka just gifted, <laughs> um, how is everyone? Like, uh, sorry, we didn't stream last weekend. It was a pretty low energy uh um, low spoon weekend for Badgie and I, so uh, neither of us were really, you know, in the mood. Uh, ah! <laughs> um, and Badgie has, uh, has other things on this weekend, um, so he can't make it. But I'm sure if he was here, he would be doing all of the cursed shit as he usually does. Uh, instead, it's just me and Elric here to entertain you. Um, so I think what we'll do is we'll do our regular food. Um, yeah, he just doesn't want to have to eat garlic. Yeah, we'll, don't worry. We're getting if we make that sub goal today with him not here. Do you know how many how much of a bragging right that'll give me over him? Like, hey, guess what I did while you were gone? <laughs> Aaliyah, thank you for subscribing. You're on a two month streak. Thank you. Wild that we've been doing this for like a month now. Uh so I think what we'll do is we will start with, uh, I've heard that TikTok has food stuff as well. I haven't really delved into the TikTok sphere much. Maybe you guys can recommend some stuff on, on the TikTok that we can look at as well. Because I'm pretty sure I can play them on the browser too. So, uh... And uh, if you want further updates for future stuff. <laughs> Whoa, Aaliyah, thank you for gifting five subs. Ah, beautiful. Now let me take note of these names so I don't forget them. Uh, Elric, no, you're not getting on the desk. You can get down, but you're not getting on the desk. Oh, okay, let me... Can I... Can I copy these names? No, stop it. <laughs> I'm being I'm being sabotaged by my cat. Hang on. Off. You see this guys? You you can't see it, but you probably doesn't pick up on the camera properly. Ah, uh, thank you, Bex. Yes, and the hype train is hype and we're at a level six hype train already. How are we doing that? Uh you guys, you guys are bringing the fire as usual. I'm just trying to find a place to put these notes. Ah, yes. Thank you. Thank you. I just saw your, your DM Bex. Excellent. Now I have these names. Beautiful. I am not an organized individual at the best of times. Ah. So, yeah, spend a little bit of time catching up with everybody. How was, how was your new year? New Year's was good for everyone, I hope. I think... Oh, uh, yeah. I was gonna... Because I don't think we, we... This is technically sort of like the first stream of the New Year, pretty sure. Or did we stream? Have we streamed already this this year? Dromeka, thank you for gifting a tier one sub to Beauclair. Um, yeah, n rough. New Year's is... I mean, I didn't really do much for New Year's. We, uh, I just chilled out. I didn't go anywhere. I was a bit lazy. I hung out, hang out in the discords. Uh, 
which uh, if you join my Patreon, you get access at all tier levels to The Burrow, which is a fun little place to hang out where we stream things and just uh, be a little bit uh, be a little bit crazy sometimes. Universal City Walk. Oh, where's that? I am an ignorant Australian. Oh, Elric is on my computer again. Uh, oh. Oh, did you just knock my hard drive out? Excellent. Well, luckily that won't affect our stream. So this is fine. It, city walk. It's in California. Okay. I assumed it was the US. Hey, Renaissa. Um, I, yeah, I, I didn't go anywhere. I should. Oh, I'm going on a, you know what I am doing this week, though, that's going to be really fun. I'm going, I'm going to, uh, a, on a haunted pub tour, which will be fun. I like doing the spooky things and there aren't a whole lot of spooky things to do here in Australia, but at least they have ghost tours, right? And I get to drink, so <laughs> that is always a plus for me. Elric, come on, buddy. Don't mind me. A haunted, a haunted pub tour. Ah, oh, you discovered me on YouTube? Hi, hi, awkward turtle. Uh, what I do here is a little different to what happens on the YouTube. Unless you mean the Twitch, the Twitch streams that I've uploaded to YouTube. Um, mainly we're just going to make, I'm going to make you all cry with some, gross food well not necessarily oh the vods yeah awesome i'm glad that they're getting out to people i wasn't sure if people would would find them or not but we have fun north omaha cat lady no fancy shit not usually gross stuff oh but if it's not gross it's not fun you have your emotional support vomit bowl ready to go. <laughs> um, Bex, if you're here, if you could, uh, if, if, Becretary, Becretary, take notes, please. Maybe. Thank you. I love you. Uh, so that I don't have to do uh, too much crazy. Yay! Our hype train finished. T Rex Gremlin Cook. So I'm not grossy as hell entertaining. Okay. Maybe. Apparently we shattered a record with that hype train, by the way, guys. All right. So. You got a giant squish. Oh. Oh, you know what I should show you? Um, you can't really see. You can sort of see them in the back here. But I got three new friends. Uh, hello, Azareth. Um, I got three new friends since I last saw you guys. I got two baby Squishmallows that a friend sent me from Canada. And you'll see another badger over there. Up there. And a cow. Uh, I have all of the new, the new stuffed friends. And it makes me very, very happy. <laughs> Uh, side note, if you want to buy anything, my throne is linked on my card. <laughs> yeah, I now have three different badges. Uh, not, not for any reason other than that they're freaking adorable. Uh, the newest badger is so goddamn good to cuddle. Thank you, Menace, by the way, for buying that for me. My throne is full of lots of fun things. I've got a crock pot on there right now as well, because if that gets funded, I will do like a crock pot stream <laughs> where I take one of those horrendous dishes that the ladies make and uh, make it um, make it for you guys. 
and maybe cry because then I'm going to have to eat it because I live alone. <laughs> You're being thanked for the badger you bought me, Menace. Is badger one of those three? No, because these are cute. <laughs> I like these three. <laughs> If one of them was Badger, it would have to live in a box permanently. And uh, they're too cute to be boxed up. You're going to do it again? Don't. <laughs> All right. Uh, I've, uh, I've chatted on long enough, I think. I think we can get started with a uh, reaction. One day you'll get a buff Badger plush. Yeah, I want to maybe, maybe a Badger with like a big beard. And then I'll put him in a little tie. And <laughs> obnoxiously much muscles, just muscle jaw. <laughs> yeah, and then he'll just live in a box. I'll just keep him in the box, and he never, he never gets to leave it. And all will be right in the world. A box hat. <laughs> all right. So what we have for those unfamiliar. I forget her name. I don't think it says it in here. Yeah, I cannot remember her name. Um, this is not sure what's cooking, a.k.a. garlic with pubes. Uh, and apparently she's making pepper chicken spaghetti, which sounds like one of the more normal things that she's actually made. Uh... You can almost recognize what it was on the thumbnail. So that's good, I guess. <laughs> um, as always, let me know how the volume is and we'll get started. Right, guys? Oh, I said play. Why are you not playing? Hey, y'all. Oh, here my God. With that not was sure what's coming. Yeah, okay. Today. She just blew out my eardrums. Excellent. Pepper chicken spaghetti. Okay, so in a big skillet, get one breast you, and cut it in little bites. You didn't reheat. Like you didn't preheat like that. This. You didn't preheat the the and skillet, go did ahead you? And fry that up. Don't put no oil or anything in it. Fry it up <laughs> medium heat. That right, medium heat. Off, that chicken ahead. went in. Ah. <laughs> you missed those kind of, uh, the garlic pube man. <laughs> hey, Def Nut Katie. Okay, see, now that pan is hot. But she put that chicken in a cold pan because it didn't make a damn sound when she put that chicken in. Like, nothing. She's not preheat. Why do they, these people not preheat pans? Marinara, marinara sauce. <laughs> it's got to be marinara, nothing else. I, I love the way she speaks. Both of them in here. Make sure you turn the heat down to um, between medium and low now. Mm -hmm. Right after you get all that marinara. Yum. <laughs> you can't see it because of the the subtitles. What is this? Hey, it's a tarry. Uh there's banana it's banana peppers, miss. Uh, uh banana peppers going into marinara sauce. Marin marinara. However, she thought to say marinara. Some of the little banana pepper rings. I'm using hot ones. Hot, hot banana pepper. Hot, then just use the mild ones and put about two tablespoons of them in there. Two, that right, doesn't seem like a lot of peppers. Two green onions and chop them up. What is with that emoji? Why is it a face palm emoji? Hey, Ubs. Thanks for subscribing for two months. Uh, yeah, why? 
why does she have what's with the face palm emoji what's happening there an edit mistake maybe i don't really think she does a whole lot of editing to be honest yeah. though <laughs> those two green onions so i guess one green onion duh <laughs> what yeah two, two halves yes two that halves does equal one green flakes, onion and that's to your parsley taste. flakes All right, after you give that yeah two tablespoons of there, pepper then stir that up sub and like hearts i mean to be fair, this does, like I said, this looks normal. Uh, like, apart from the fact we know there's banana peppers in there. Um, I think this would be edible. That look good. Real look good. <laughs> Real anyway, look good. Put a lid on it and still keep the fire on low. Keep putting and lid it on it. For about 10 minutes or so. All right, y'all. <laughs> Why does it? Yes, sir. And this taste. What is with putting raw green onion on everything? Why? Why did we need raw green onion on? On this pasta, it doesn't make any sense. Yeah, texturally, it's just. It's just chicken. It's chicken in marinara sauce. It's. It'd be fine, I guess. I, it didn't need the spring onion. A little bitty bite. Don't use hot banana peppers, guys. Don't. Oh, that's what they are. Yeah, this is relatively normal for her. Like, I know it doesn't look great, guys, but... Oh, you're making your readers cry. Menace being menace. Yeah, like, I mean... Oh. Oh, no. No, I didn't want to replay it. Why? Go away. Yeah, look. To be fair, that's probably one of the more normal looking dishes, like considering like we've seen some of her stuff in the past, like the shrimp and bacon, the the bacon mango cheeseburger soup, like this stuff is, uh, ooh, what about woohoo veggie jambalaya? Are we, you may, yeah, Sharky, don't worry, you didn't miss much, we only really, uh, I, I, I kind of just sat around bullshitting for the first, like, near 20 minutes, so you only really missed a little bit. I want a jar labeled fanned tears. <laughs> yeah, like I said, that is, like, I don't know what this is going to be like. Probably going to make people... Hey, y'all, sure. Hey, I didn't say you could play. Uh, she's making jambalaya. Now, I don't know a whole lot about jambalaya, but I feel like people that do are not going to be pleased with how she makes jambalaya. So let's find out. <laughs> okay, what is the surprise in the jambalaya? Do we want to know what the surprise in? Will I need, will you need headphones? Uh, look, it's just me today. Uh, not saying that I can't, you know, get a little frisky. But, uh, it's just me. So you should be safe without headphones. More banana coated food. <laughs> no. I mean, yeah, frisky critter. Yeah, you know. You know, sometimes, sometimes I can do the whole lean into the mic and get real low. <laughs> uh, but no, we're going to look at Jambalaya and, and as long as Elric remains behaving as he is there, you can see him. Unfortunately, my mic arm's in the way, but 
You can sort of uh, see Elric chilling out there. Well, today I am going to be making some jambalaya. Jamba. My headphones turned off. How rude. They go inactive after a certain amount of time. Yeah, this niggly ma Now, wait. She's making jambalaya from a packet mix. This is already not a good idea, right? You know, Cajun tasty food. All right. Now, make sure that you watch um, out for... Um, I'm going to be doing another... Ja <laughs> Uh, good good news, guys. It's reduced sodium jambalaya. One pot. Uh, you lied. That's all three strikes. Yeah. I've made jambalaya. Back when I was vegan, I made a vegan jambalaya from scratch. So, so she's not showing us that... She's not showing us the jambalaya that she makes from scratch. Instead, she decided she would record the jambalaya from the packet. Show us the one you do from scratch. Why record this? Show us the nice jambalaya. Five, so this will be nice and tasty and quick. And now, quick. The way that I make it from scratch and probably is bad. Not as quick like that but it is really really delicious yeah so show us right, that so one, first of all, you're gonna need one pack of the jambalaya. yeah it kind of does sound like she's saying jambalaya doesn't it i think it's just her accent though she's uh i think i heard she's from the ozarks i'm not p super familiar with that area though because i live in australia A big old scratch to shit at the bottom pan. Is she going to cut the peppers up with scissors again? Is she using scissors instead of a knife again? Please tell me she isn't about to use the scissors on the peppers. More of the little bell peppers to it. But everything in this is fine for this jambalaya. Actually, this is a really jambalaya. Uh, jambalaya. Um, jambalaya. But I'm still going to go ahead and add some extra peppers. Extra peppers. All right, get those peppers cut up. Mix that jambalaya. Extra peppers. Extra peppers. All right, get those peppers cut up. Mix that jambalaya up. All right, this is how I want you to no. See, that is a face yeah, palm emoji that works. This is, this is really going to add some extra um, taste to it. Extra um, taste, like huh? I said, the, the mix has a great taste. It's almost Does like it? making it from scratch. Is it? It's just as good. But anyway, is it just as good as making it from scratch? Keep all my seeds. I dry them out. Again, I'm pretty sure she just tossed those into a fucking cold pan. That's a cold pan. Why is she never? Why do they never heat their pan? Why does no one fucking heat their pan? And I'm sure y'all have seen my other videos where I dry out every seed that I can get. What the fuck? And yeah. also, is her phone in her fucking pocket? How? Why is the sound going in and out like that? Uh, you're looking at seeds. So she's, uh, I guess she's frying off the seeds in a cold pan. I put them in a little freeze lock baggie and freeze them. And then sticking the phone in her fucking there pocket. You might need those seeds one day. Look how pretty that is. Okay, we've missed some steps, lady. We miss some fucking steps. You can't just cut from seeds in a cold pan to this. What happened in between? What? How did we get, literally, we went from this to this. This to this. You never know. You might need those seeds one day. 
What did you do between this? Where is the rest of the recipe? Pretty that looks with those different colored uh, bell peppers in there. Thumbs up, guys. All right, now get you some crawfish tails and see. I Wait, okay, yeah, but how did you get the broth? D what did you do for the... <sighs> Seeds, broth, magic. It's just, it's just magic, guys. Like, ooh. I don't get why. Did she cut it? Because, like, did, did she just forget to film that step? Is she going to mention it? Cut it in half. We're only going to use a half a package of this. Only yeah, half the crawfish tails. Too, I'm using the crawfish. Plus another meat, too, so stick around. Oh, God, what's the other meat? Oh. Again, how did we get to the broth? Hey, they just, you know... Also, what is that fucking emo... What is that emoticon for? What is the crazy silly face for? <laughs> yeah, another meat. She hasn't told us what the other meat is, guys. Yeah, it's her husband. She totally killed and is boiling her husband in this jambalaya. Or, well, uh, well you see, Badgie's not here today, so... Uh... Maybe Badgie made it into her jambalaya, too? Dump that in there, and it's okay if it's still frozen, because it'll, you know, come apart as it's... Yeah, as it's right. cooking in that this broth that we still don't know how you made. I do extra with this uh, jambalaya mix. Now, have you cooking like her third cousin. Had mixed veggies in your jambalaya? Have you ever had mixed veggies in your jambalaya, guys? How about you? you? You putting frozen mixed vegetables in your jambalaya? You putting crawfish tails and some other meat that is, yeah, not saying it's badger, but it's probably badger? <laughs> well, today we are going to. This is just an added um, taste to. An added taste. And telling you Woo! she telling you guys you gotta add those frozen mixed veggies to your jambalaya do it make this recipe tell me how it goes you're missing out you need yeah. to get some of these how how what right, what is happening oh she put the whole she bag ah there's our other meat cajun style sausage well, Cajun style sausage, crawfish tails, frozen mixed veggies, some seeds, uh, a broth that just appeared out of a cut in in time. I don't know. It just suddenly broth in pot. Uh, it's good sausage, is it? I don't know. We don't get that style of sausage here. So the squares make it spicy. <laughs> oh. The filter she puts on the end product kills me every time. She she puts the little sparkly filter, so it's like all like shiny. All those <laughs> colors in there. It looks like festive, doesn't it? Festive. It's generally not how I would describe jambalaya, but sure. The crawfish and the sausage and all the veggies. All right, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn the fire up on high. Uh huh. Stick by it because you don't want it to scorch on the bottom. Yeah. Bring it to don't let it burn. A boil. All right, Make sure the crawfish tails and sausage is done. Make sure the cra it should be if the water is all absorbed. Yeah, frozen seafood just uh What was the seeds for? I think that was like her spice. That was adding That was her adding spice to the dish. I mean, yeah, look, if you're just feeding yourself, it's like her last meal that we watched. If you were just eating that pasta on your own, I probably wouldn't add the green onions. But, you know, I'd eat it. After it starts boiling, you're going to turn And maybe I'd eat this. Oh, well, no, I wouldn't. It's got crawfish in it. I don't eat seafood. But, you know, it if it didn't have crawfish in it, I'd eat it. For about 20 to 25 minutes. Um... 
and just make sure that you've got that. I just can't believe she skipped the whole step with the broth. And check it in between. At her last meal. No, it was her husband's last meal, Drameka. Her husband's last meal. <laughs> because then she put him in the jambalaya. She had to fatten him up for the for the sausage to be the jambalaya mystery meat. Oh, it is done. Uh, she yeah she yeah she keeps the seeds so she keeps like you know how you can take the seeds out of peppers, so she freezes the seeds from the peppers. Uh, one because I know she has her own garden. Um, so I'm pretty sure she saves the seeds to plant them as well. But yeah, she also cooks with the seeds. She put ho poison. <laughs> I mean, the dirty rice. Yeah, I've made dirty rice before, actually, and I really like it. I want to do it again. Not a lot of southern food in Australia, but what I have had has been nice. But I've had to cook it all myself because nowhere, nowhere does southern food here. Yeah, they were like chili seeds, I think. And also, stay tuned for that, too, because I'm going to... Wait, what? What is she making? Own Creo seasoning. Creo? Wait, is it called Creo seasoning? I thought it was... Is it supposed to be Creole seasoning? Yeah, why is she calling it Creo? What? Why is she calling it Creo? To share that recipe with you. She's going to share her Creo recipe, guys. Big old bite of it. A big old bite. Nom. Oh, my goodness. This Crawfish so and good. salt? So Did you add salt? So, on that note, I'm Did you add to salt to your salt-reduced jambalaya mix? Why would you do that? That defeats the purpose. Oh, because I am hungry. Oh, I, I bet it does. You, believe it? You, you can, can make, make this. this. And until next time, y'all, be blessed and safe. Bye. Bye. Well, that was still depressingly normal-ish. It's not one of her experimental creations that we've seen in the past, which... I want another, like, what, Cajun bean soup? What is, oh, look, she's on a Cajun bent. She did Cajun bean soup, jambalaya. You don't feel blessed or safe? She doesn't, she doesn't make you feel safe, Bunny? Doesn't, doesn't make you want to feel all warm and comforted? Just want to be wrapped up in that uh, big old pot of jambalaya. Ugh. Mm. Okay. Yes, yeah, screw it. We'll do her a third one too. <laughs> she makes me un feel unsafe and mildly disturbed. Oh, guys. But only, you see, it's all about how you frame it. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta frame it. Like, it just think of the rice as a warm, comforting pillow surrounding you, you know? Keeping you all snug and cozy. Don't you just want to drift off to sleep? All smothered in it. Let's, uh, let's see what a bean soup is like, shall we? And I don't know why it says I've watched this. I haven't. No. So what is wrong with you? YouTube, please. Please, YouTube. Please, Daddy YouTube. Can you behave? Hey, y'all. Sheree here with Not Sure What's you don't feel mildly disturbed anymore? <laughs> smothered. Oh, smothered in something, not the rice. Uh, I mean, I, I, I can... Uh, bean soup. Hey, 
bean soups can if bean soups are done well they can be amazing like never underestimate a bean soup and the good thing about them is you can use canned beans in them and you can make them super fucking cheap you can make heaps of it you can freeze it you can have it with nice like crunchy bread and it's just like a cheap winter meal you know like the best i love soup love love bean soups Today I am going to be making a Cajun sausage soup. Oh, a Cajun hey, sausage I'm soup. Take about okay. Half a bag of the large llama beans and rinse them off real good. Are they? That's a bag of. Are they fresh llama beans? Bing bong, you don't like beans? What? Orbs, you've never heard of bean soup before? Like any bean soup? Oh, those are dried beans? Okay. It's hard to, like, hard to tell what I'm looking at. Yeah, unsoaked beans. I'm assuming she's going to soak them, right? I normally yeah. use tinned beans because I'm lazy. Can if want to, but... Wait, you, you aren't soaking them? Don't you have to soak them? My day? My day is kind of only really just starting. It's only just like 11.30 in the morning here. So I I went, I I don't have my fake nails anymore. I got, I had them removed. You can't really see because of the light, but my nails are gone. I'm sad, but you know, I wanted to give my own na nails time to uh, strengthen again before I put some more fake ones on because I, I noticed they were getting real thin. Uh, but yeah, she's not soaking her beans, guys, and I'm scared. Why isn't she soaking her beans? Is that this... I'm pretty sure you have to soak those dried beans, right? Like, is she going to boil the shit out of them? I never, what is ever she? soak them. You've never I ever soak your beans. Okay, they're going in a crock pot. Okay. That that would explain it, maybe. Is that another fucking that looks like the jambalaya box from before? That smoked sausage. Crock pot bean soup. We got, yeah, we got a surprise crock pot. I wasn't expecting a crock pot recipe from her, but we got one, guys. I didn't even have to go to one of our other ladies for crock pot stuff. That's a, that's a bonus. The Sataran sausage. And then what I Wait, Sataran? That's not how you say that, right? Z Zataran. Z Zataran? Yeah. Hmm. It sounded like she said it with an S, but I'm guessing that's just her accent. What I want you to do, just cut them up in pieces like this. Yeah, cut them up, them stick them in there with your unsoaked All fucking right, beans. Thumbs up to the Walmart minced onion and parsley flakes. Hooray! Minced onion and some parsley flakes. And the minced onion, you're going to take one and a half tablespoons and dump okay it in why not just use lady i know you have fucking onions just use an actual onion and parsley that's just to your taste to your taste however okay, fucking much you want bean soup but it is called cajun sausage soup what the fuck is this andouille sausage and andouille flavored zatarain i don't I don't know. This is this is your country, guys. This ain't mine. Yeah, look, I think this is just because everything is floating on the top of the water. Uh, but why didn't she just use fresh onion? She could have used fresh onion. It's all going in a fucking crock pot anyway. And it's a crock pot, uh, crock pot easy. And crock pot easy. We'll feed eight people. 
Eight people. Eight people can share in the misery of whatever the fuck this turns out as. Also, she didn't soak or rinse her beans, so good luck to everyone with the gas that's coming the next day. Dish. I mean, you know, this big crock pot um, soup here. That's <laughs> what I'm trying to say. Um, and it costs eight dollars to make. Eight dollar. That's a dollar a serve, yo. In this economy, in this economy, you can have a dollar of this yummy bean soup. Eight bucks feeds eight people. When are you going to get a deal like that, right? Feed eight people. All right, the Cajun seasoning is in the sausage, so you don't need to add any Don't need to add any more. Don't need to add any more seasoning, guys, because the sausage has seasoning in it. So, you know, that'll just diffuse through the whole fucking soup pot. No need to add any more. And then just put some salt and pepper to your taste. Now wait until the end because I it's am bean going soup. To put a surprise in there. It's so Cajun anyway, bean soup. Turn this on low and cook it for wait, she put another fucking surprise in there, guys. Guys, is this the one? Is this the one where she's put her husband in the bottom of the soup pot? There's another fucking surprise in here. Is it? It looks like dirty water. How is that looking yummy? It just it just looks like dirty water. I can't wait until this is done. Because it it's her is second cold husband. Outside and this will warm your bones. Yeah, I was gonna say three hours doesn't seem long enough to cook dried beans, does it? Like even if it is a crock pot, she said it's a crock pot, not a pressure cooker. So I feel like those beans aren't done. I, after it's cooked for three hours, um, which it hasn't yet, but well, why'd after you, it is, why, um, stick around because I'm going to show you another ingredient you're going to put in it. Uh-huh. Right, guys. Y'all, after it has cooked for three hours. It's cooked for three. Hey, yeah, hey, Sherry, what in the one. sick? What in the sick? It's... It's Cajun bean soup. Do you want some? Oh, look, it's Creole seasoning. Oh, Creole. Yeah, Creole. Actually, Creole seasoning. Teaspoon. Then you're going to add two more cups of water. And then you would eat it for me, Cherry. Ah, uh, is that and her you ingredient? Can this in all at one time if you want. Also, she said she wasn't adding any seasoning because of the sausage, but then she's like, ah, I got Creo seasoning. I'm putting that in too. You want a little texture to them, but not much. Uh huh. Right, this box right here is a 12 ounce, so you're going to put a quarter of a box in there. Right, that's all. Those are fucking huge. Jumbo I'm pretty sure, that's... wait, those jumbo shells, right? You're supposed to use them when you want to, like, do filled, like, pasta dishes, right? Those aren't supposed to go in soups. Like, you have to cut that with a fucking knife and fork. There's no way you're eating that as, like, with a soup spoon. What is she doing with the... You don't... That's not what you use those for. Why is she putting them in soup? But they're so big. Like, what are you, you eating your soup with a knife and fork now? <laughs> and yeah, they're going in the crock pot. How long is she cooking these in the crock pot for? They're going to be mush. Which one is the big jumbo ones? Why do you want the big jumbo ones? Right, if, if you're wanting to put this on and have it for dinner, um, you know, while you're at work or wherever, um, then you can go ahead and put those shells in there. It is completely fine. I just is like it? putting them in after three hours of cooking um, it in the crock pot. But then just go ahead and dump everything in there and then just cook it dump it. Six to um, eight hours. Oh no, you aren't you didn't just put that pasta in there and you're gonna cook it for another six to fucking eight hours? Why'd you put the pasta in now? It's going to be obliterated. 
six to eight fucking hours with pasta shells in there? What is she doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Hours on low. On low. Okay, never mind. It's on low, guys. I put eight cups of water in it to start it off. Yeah, so you did. Oh, you're going to... Eight if you're going to cook it for six to eight hours. Okay, got to add those extra couple right. of cups. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cover this and cook it for another uh, two hours. Okay, no, two hours. Okay. On low. Two. All right, look at this. Yeah, bye-bye pasta shells. You could have literally put any other type of fucking pasta in there. So it didn't need to be the big jumbo shells. Can you guys see the pasta shells? Because I fucking can't. I mean, I'm going to tell you, this will feed eight people easily. Look I don't like it. That's a big ball right there. What the fuck is that? It's Attack of the Beige Soup. The beige has come back to haunt us. She didn't even have to fucking add cream cheese and we got beige. Like, that's a, that's a feat. It doesn't even look like soup anymore. Like, what is this? It's just disintegrated shells, some sausage, some beans. It all looks the same color. Like... Oh. oh, she didn't disappoint this time, did she, guys? Oh. Food, and it's so filling and delicious, and I've already taken a bite, and it is... Yeah, that is true. We didn't get to see a shit ring, but she didn't really... She had a full pot of water, so we didn't see the shit ring. Also, she didn't really add any fucking seasonings to the pot, so there was nothing to stick to the shit ring. <laughs> now, you could take this and be creative with it. Put some cheese or... Oh, yeah, because that's what that needs. Cheese. Cheese will save it. Cheese will definitely make this better. Some uh, onions. You know, green or onions some onions. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's your where's your chopped up green onions that normally go on fucking everything? Why didn't they make it on top of this? And on top of it. Um, or some Parmesan cheese. More I cheese, yeah. Nothing because I like the flavor of the Cajun seasoning and I don't want nothing to take away from that. Nothing to take away but from that Cajun seasoning, guys. Cornbread, crackers, the souls of small children. Please give me a thumbs up. I sure will. Their hands make it. great little spoons. And just remember, if you believe it, you can make this. And until next time, be blessed and safe, y'all. Bye. It all just looks the one color. <sighs> How did you make it all look one color? Like, could you have not have added some paprika or something in there? Something. All the thumbs went in the soup. Yes, they did. You need a reward after that one? Ah. Uh, thank you, Jamaica. Strongly disturbed <laughs> by this meal. Yeah, be safe, be safe and blessed, yeah, safe and blessed. You know, she she praying for yous, she praying for yous with, with this, this. Uh, in case you've joined later uh, and you've been following along the last few streams, we are still on, on our way to the sub goal of 100 subs. When we get to 100 subs... Badgie is going to eat garlic. So if you can, if you can afford to sub, if you can't, that's cool. Just make sure you're following the channel. Uh, we appreciate the support. We're at 41. We're almost halfway, guys. We're almost halfway to making Badger eat garlic. Like, 
And that is, that's pretty goddamn funny. <laughs> he's not going to be able to worm his way out of it. Um, make If we hit this goal, he's doing it. Uh, but I, And as always, I appreciate your guys' support so much because, you know. And my headset turned itself off again. Uh, all right, now... Thank you, Bunny, for subbing. Uh, let's see what mm, what Sammy is doing. Um, oh, no. See, she's got these damn repeat. She's been doing this thing lately where she's making, like, compilations of her older recipes. So you think you're getting new videos... But what you're actually getting is, like, stuff from her other videos. Uh, yeah, the, you, I'm not going to lie. Every time I think about the fact that we are, like, we're, you know, we're, we're getting to the point where we get to make Badger eat just straight jarred garlic is, uh, it brings me so much serotonin every time I think about it, guys, like you don't understand uh okay so we're mandy nothing oh one thing about tamra here right she commented on our on our christmas video guys like she actually commented on on our christmas stream re-upload <laughs> which was so goddamn funny um yeah, it was, uh, I was just like, wait, and it was like, because we, I think we were making a comment about the frozen chicken at the time, because she was dumping some frozen chicken in a crock pot, and she's like, definitely frozen, laughy emojis, uh, so she, she was fine, like, she, she didn't say anything mean or anything, she saw the humor in it, I guess, she seems like she's a nice lady. So, uh, that was nice. Um, it was nice to see it. Oh, our weekly from scratch favorites. Cozy casseroles. Uh, you know, hmm. You know what? All these casseroles look the same, which means we better watch this one. <laughs> Everything looks the same. Cozy casseroles. He knows. Yeah, well, I mean, to be fair, Menace, we didn't have a stream last week. So there was no stream for him to be in. This week, you know, maybe he's shaking his, in his boots. Maybe you guys got him running scared. So, you know. Let's scare him a bit more and see how many more subs we can get before the stream ends, huh? And who knows? Maybe, uh, maybe I can give you a little something something too. If, uh, if you guys do well. Cozy casseroles. Cozy casseroles. Her little freaking intro. Feeding my family. Hey guys, a welcome back or welcome to our Menace. Thank you for this five thank you for gifting five subs. We're almost at fifty. That's exciting. To today's video, I'm gonna be sharing three super easy and delicious recipes with you guys. Today's video is extra special because it is a part of collaboration hosted by my good good friend Sammy over at Managing the Maze. Managing the Maze, the queen of the beige cream cheese crock pot dish. Check out that playlist. You're gonna find all of delicious cozy casseroles that you have got to make for this cold winter season. I hope you enjoy those subs, guys. By the way, I noticed it last time we were last stream but we are now actually just gifting random subs into the universe so 
one day these poor bastards are going to go, oh, I got gifted a sub for something. And they're going to come and find this content. So they got you guys to thank for that. <laughs> What's that? Oh, see, she softens her cream cheese. See, 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 Mandy, this is what you need to do. You need to soften your cream cheese, not just put a whole fucking brick of it in stuff. And it might be heavy, so I forgot to sit it out. <laughs> now, the recipe that I am loosely following, I'll make sure to have linked down below for you guys, but I am changing a couple things. Loosely followed a recipe. You guys are following recipes? For blended cottage cheese. Wait. Did she say she's subbing out? You're gonna sub out the sour cream. Wait, so she is she's subbing sour cream and mayonnaise, and instead of using either of those, she's using blended cottage cheese. How are they? remotely similar cottage cheese is not sour cream or mayonnaise like you found out why cream cheese curdles oops i mean i imagine it curdles because she dried it the fuck out on the top of a crock pot i don't they just don't feel like adequate substitutes. Like, why would you sub out sour cream and mayo for for cottage cheese? Oh, and heavy cream. Okay. But how's she getting the sour? So then I add in garlic. Alright. Oh, it's garlic. Keep subbing so we can make Badger eat that. Add as little or as much as you want. Uh, if you don't let it come to room temperature. Ah, oh, that's fair. I don't really cook with cream cheese. No, oh, we got some seasonings. Bunny, thank you so much for gifting us up. We appreciate it. I did already cook my chicken. I went ahead and cooked it. I actually just cooked enough for two different recipes. That chicken was boiling in. Was it supposed to be fried chicken or boiled chicken? Because that was a lot of liquid in that chicken. Hey, Orbs, thank you for gifting five tier one subs. Uh, we've now hit the halfway point. We're over halfway to Badger having to eat jarred garlic, guys. Can we make him miserable next stream? <laughs> So you can use rotisserie chicken if you'd like. And now I'm gonna add in my can of artichokes. I just drained off. Oh, okay. We got we got artichokes. Yeah, cool. What the fuck are we making? Oh, <laughs> thank you, Orbs. God, how much cheese? Wait, how much cheese was that? That looked like a whole packet of cheese. I'm going to add in some Parmesan cheese. Okay, no, maybe half a packet of Parmesan. Pa pa I can't even speak. Parmesan cheese. I'm adding in fresh spinach. The recipe calls for frozen. I'm going to add in my cooked chicken. 
Okay, yeah. You know what? Apart from the weird cottage cheese sub instead of sour cream, I probably think this would be okay. Oh, you're going to top it with more cheese. Yeah, of course you are. I mean, I'm sure this it it's all very one color, but seems fine. Ah, yes, cheese. So she has so she had cottage cheese. She had cottage cheese, cream cheese, parmesan, mozzarella. She has like four different types of cheese in that one casserole. <laughs> this recipe is definitely a keeper. It is delicious. I mean, I'd eat that. Just looks like cheese casserole. Wasn't any crazy canned cheese soup or anything in there. So uh, it just looks very bland apart from that. Oh. oh my god, that is the shittest frozen broccoli mix. That's mostly all stock. Look at that. That poor broccoli. Like, look, this, this bit here is literally just a stalk. <laughs> and this bit there's no broccoli on there it's just stock <laughs> fucking great value my ass chicken broccoli top casserole, chicken, broccoli, top casserole. okay one of my favorite things that I make so I've got a bag of broccoli and I just defrost it a little you know microwave and now I'm just kind of cutting it up into smaller Okay. Pieces just to make it a little bit more manageable. And Why are you cutting it in the bowl like that? Is that good for the bowl? That's a plastic bowl. I'm going to add in the other chicken. Okay, yeah, some more chicken. Got to have the chimkin. No. No, what is that? What the fuck is that? That better not be condensed cheese soup. That better not be fucking cheese soup. Oh, never mind it. Oh, no, that's it. Yeah, it's a... What do you mean cream of chicken? That's fucking cheddar. That can says cheddar on it. Yeah, that's a cheddar. That says fucking cheddar cheese on it. What are you talking about? Show me the fucking can. Cream of chicken, my ass. Yeah, yeah, cheddar cheese. Cheddar fucking cheese soup. That's what that is. Ugh. Why is there always cheese soup in things? Why is that cheese soup in everything? <laughs> oh, sorry. I, you can use cream of chicken if you like, but she has cheddar cheese. Wait, you had sour cream? Why didn't you use sour cream in the other casserole? Why did you sub in cottage cheese? You have sour cream. I mean, I don't know how far apart these were made, but why do the substitute? Bacon. Oh. oh, that was a nice plop. Oh. Listen to the bacon plop. Oh. That was a, that was a plop. That was a nice plop, guys. Like, I want to sample that bacon plop. Bacon. 
plop. I'm just gonna season it with some salt and pepper. I can't get over that fucking cheese soup. It just looks like an, a yellow, unnatural horror. Like, the fact that people use it, these people seem to use it so regularly. Gonna add it to the grease casserole dish. I hope it doesn't make it through quarantine, Bex. I hope to God that Australian Customs goes, what is this? Clearly it's a weapon that will destroy the country. I guess we have to burn it. <gasps> tater tots and guys 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 unlike mandy who puts her tater tots on the bottom of her casseroles tamra is going to put it on the top so we're not going to get soggy ass tater tots yeah it's like a tater tot casserole thing What is that cheese? What is... This is some sort of American blend of cheese because I've never fucking seen this before. Add cheese soup to throne. Well, no, it's different colours. Like, I don't know how well you guys can see it, but um, it's all different colours. I think it's like a mix. Oh, and there's the tater tot. They're not regular tater tots. They're not the right shape. What are those? I was expecting like, you know, nugget tater tot tater rounds. <laughs> oh, you guys can get rounds? We only have one shape of tater tot. That makes me sad. I want the rounds. I always like to season my tater tots before I put it in the oven. Really? I mean, you can just season them when they're done. Salt and pepper. But it's not really going to make a difference, is it? for about 30 minutes. Yeah. He was so happy that I finally got around to making one of his favorite meals. That shit be bubbling. I mean, it just looks like tater tots on a bed of nuclear cheese. <laughs> That's what it looks like. <laughs> mm. Oh, this looks... Oh, I haven't been asking you guys how the volume is. I'm assuming it's okay, right? <sighs> this is... <sighs> guys. Guys, why do they all end up using so much cheese that everything looks the same? Oh, uh, you, it, it, it's like the taste of home for you, is it, Curly? Tater tots are a weird thing. Like, I like them, but they're not really an Australian thing. <gasps> it's our friend, the Meat Masher! Meat Masher, Meat Masher! I missed you, old friend. Tonight I'm making a uh, beef Philly. And I'm going to do it all in the Yes, pan. mash that so meat. Can, mash it good. You know, transfer it into a casserole dish. Why do it in the pan? Because she's breaking it up so it'll cook. Gotta mash your meat well. Mash. <laughs> I'm just, th these pans of mine are oven safe, so I keep it simple. And I can, you know, keep it. 
Oh, she gonna put the whole pan in the oven. So nice. Cooking up my ground beef. I have about a pound and a half here. I'm going to see. What do y'all know about mashing pepper. meat? I'm just gonna keep it simple on some salt and pepper. And then when this gets almost cooked, I'll add in some minced garlic. Yay! Oh, I hope it's jarred garlic. I hope. Cooked. Ooh, naughty, Dramaica. And make this really quick. So I'm going to cook this up first, then I'll bring you guys back. Oh. <gasps> yes, Jalik. <laughs> Just a certain, a certain appendage being uh, mashed with a meat masher. I mean, I don't have, I, I, I lack that certain appendage, but I imagine it wouldn't be too bad, right? It's only plastic after all. Or two. And I bet there's someone with a fetish, actually, that wants that used on their junk. Not going to lie. Someone out there is paying someone else to use a meat masher on their balls. Any money. much as you want. This ground beef is almost cooked up. Now I'm also going to add in is that onion, capsicum, and onions. I'm using frozen peppers and onions. That um, pan doesn't seem <gasps> Is that cream cheese? Is that cream cheese, Tamara? You eating cream cheese? Um, cream cheese. Yeah. Now the recipe that I'm following, I'll have linked down below. And the comments said that they thought it needed more cream cheese. So I'm adding a full block. Good night, Chucky. Sleep well. I really got to start trying to do an earlier in the day stream, but... And I'm just going to... Like... I try and like run around and do the stuff I need to on Saturdays before I start the stream. Stream. Oh, you're actually going to go to bed this time? Otherwise, I'll have to find some actual nightmares to send you to bed to. Or maybe you'll want a bedtime story. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep well, Sharky. Onion powder, garlic powder, and some paprika. Hey, some actual seasonings. Salt and pepper. Get this all mixed together. Now, after I top it with cheese, I'll put it in the oven. Now, of course, if your pan is not oven. It just occurred, oh, maybe that's not a non-stick pan, and maybe that's why she's using a metal spoon on it. But I was always taught to never use metal on metal, so... That scraping sound has given me the ick. Oven safe, then you would need to transfer this to an oven safe pan, and then top it with your cheese, and then get it put in the oven. You could definitely serve this on, like, slider buns or hoagie buns. That squelch it. There's a lot of squelching happening. I feel like you could also um, <gasps> Well, hello, Loop. You don't want some minced cream cheese and peppers? Why is it so wet? She added cream cheese. Is it just the cream cheese? Did we miss another liquid? Because it feels like... Ah... Thank you for gifting a sub to Loop, Dramecca. We appreciate. Uh, yeah, Loop, uh, she's making casserole, but... Yeah, why is it so wet? I swear all she put in there was cream cheese. I think it would be good. Oh, maybe the liquid from the frozen peppers? Mm, we didn't see her drain off the fat. I mean, it could have happened before she added the peppers, but she has not shown us that she did. Yep. 
Yeah, it's gonna be a casserole. Doesn't it look like a casserole, Loop? God, look at it. What is that? Is that a pasta sheet? Oh no, it's cheese. Is that cheese? What are those round cheese things? Oh, provolone. Okay. Because she's going to, yeah, because this is a skillet she can put in the oven. Oh, there we go. Not going to lie, this looks exactly like the first one. Like, if we went back, and we can because this is like the end of the video. If we went back. It looks identical. Ah, fuck it. YouTube's being really slow. Here, and we did not love this recipe. You didn't love not this recipe? That I can't do here at the house myself. It just needs a little extra love. So we're definitely going to try this recipe again, but I'm going to change it up and. Underneath the toasty cheese is horrors untold. I'm going to add other ingredients other than just the cream cheese in that beef mixture and see if it gives it a little bit extra love. But nonetheless, I really hope y'all enjoyed today's video. I hope it gave you some new... Yeah, look, it just looks like the first one. It looks like a, a different shaped version of the first one. The idea is... Please make sure you check out that playlist. And thank you so much, Sammy, for hosting today. Hey! And I will see hello! You all in the next one. Bye, guys. Welcome. <sighs> there was so much cheese. So, so much cream cheese. Now, we have a couple of options. Oh, YouTube, why are you being so slow? My browsers. I think are finally starting to hate the fact that I have a million of them open. Um, so at some point I'm probably going to have to try and troubleshoot why it's being really slow lately. Uh, not, I hope that's not affecting the stream quality for you guys though. It's just been a bit laggy when I'm like full screening and minimizing it. You guys can't see all my tabs because I have another window open to hide my shame. <laughs> uh, it seems fine. Good, good. Uh, the tab. What? You don't like my tabs? You're not a fan of my tabs, guys? I don't think there's that many. <laughs> it's not that many tabs. Uh now a couple of options i do have those folks that we were told about earlier on tiktok or we can find our own k's cooking video to, to watch because we don't have badgie here to recommend one to us so what do you think we should do guys We can, you want to do K? She just posted one recently. Oh, maybe we should see what her new, her new one is. I forget which one of her new channel is. Because she has the two. Oh yeah, leftover. Oh no. Okay, so we have a few. <gasps> That's the one that I couldn't remember the name of. Josh and Mama. Someone showed me... Someone showed me a video from them. And then I forgot then. What the fuck is that? What is that? What? What? What is that? Come on, come on, YouTube. Mama, this can't be your lunch. That. <laughs> What's wrong with that? 
I hate my internet right now. Internet, please, please. Yeah, I hadn't really heard of her. Someone told me about her. I forgot the name again and Rain just reminded me. Um, yeah, I haven't... What? Banner Sausage? What is that? Mama, this can't be your lunch. That <laughs> What's wrong with that? Wait, so how are you gonna... How are you gonna make it that... I'm just gonna put it on the bread. What? What the fuck? It said it was sausage. They said it was sausage on the tit. That's not fucking sausage. What is that? Mom. Ah, uh, and now the now the YouTube quality. Why did it go to two forty? Fuck off. Wait, why does it only go up to four eighty? Why is four eighty the top quality? What? What is this? Fucking 2005? 480 is the fucking hot. Uh, what, Josh? <laughs> it stinks. It smells like cat. Oh, I just. Why? What is that? Like, it, it, yeah, it looks like cat food. In fact, actually, no. The food that I feed Fatty there looks more like food than that does. Like, Elric eats better than this lady. That food. Well, then go in there. Are you going to heat it up or anything? Yes, I'm going to heat it up. Just In the microwave? Oh my god, look at it. Oh. Mom. <laughs> Thank you. I think you need to at least like cook it longer. No, I don't. I don't know if it's cooked all the way. It's wait, are you sp wait, okay. Does anyone know if this product can be eaten uncooked because that that doesn't look cooked. Can that be eaten raw? Like yeah, good point. And that's a plastic plate. Why is she not using a regular plate? I have so many questions. Is she going to die from eating this clearly still raw sausage meat? It's fine. Will it help if I melt the cheese for you, Josh? I cannot sit here. <laughs> I can't. What in the ever-loving hell was that? Like, what is this? Why? What, <laughs> like, what was that? <laughs> Makes a butter candle? Mama makes cheese dip. Oh, a traditional New Year's. Oh, that's a short. Can we find an actual video? Let's have an actual video that isn't a short. Ah, oh, they do a lot of shorts. Okay, I see. Why'd she get lip injection? Wait, what? Uh, the Thanksgiving one, okay. Let's see if we could find that. What? Everything looks the fucking same. That's not shepherd's pie. What is that? What is that? That's not shepherd's pie. Is that craft fucking singles on top? Why? 
No, she's trying sushi. She's not making it, thank God. Mama tries Mexican can't. What is that? Is that uncooked hot dogs in baked beans? I... This is the Thanksgiving one. Is that canned mac and cheese? You're not even going to make your own mac and cheese? It's Thanksgiving. Beanie weenies. I'm not eating shit called beanie weenies. Oh, no, no, no. Come on, at least use fresh ham. No, not tinned ham. Look at it. Oh my God. That's the same ham that your grandma used to eat. I was poor. I didn't eat this shit. Actually, this shit is actually more expensive than just eating, like, the processed fresh shit. Like, the deli loaf? Um, that stuff is like five bucks a tin here. Like, I get the beanie weenies and, and the baked beans. I can see that working. I hate this. This stuff? I hate tinned meat. I can't, I can't do spam. I tried to like spam. I did... Spam is like $8 a tin here. It's expensive. It has a weird consistency. Yeah, no place for fresh produce or meats. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I do understand the with the food desert thing. I mean, where I grew up, so I grew up in a country town. We didn't have access to like fresh markets and things. We would often just use frozen. We had a lot of frozen food, foods growing up. Um, we would have these things called deep fry nights on like the weekends where basically you could take anything frozen that you could deep fry and just throw it in a fryer, which over here was often like uh, dim sims, um, potato cakes, which I don't know what you guys would call those, but they're like just a fried potato like th circle, like that big that you deep fry um, and like chips and stuff like nuggets. Anything you could put in a fryer, my mum put in a fryer. Uh, but yeah, we never really had this stuff because for the amount of uh, money you would spend for the small amount that you'd get, it wasn't like a financially viable option like for our family. Because yeah, those are, exp I don't know what they are, what the cost is in America, but that shit over here isn't cheap. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> it looks so sad. <laughs> why? Why are you cutting it in the middle? Why didn't you use a cutting board? You guys own a cutting board, right? Boom. I'm like a. Yeah, we would use we would use frozen meats around Christmas time and stuff. We don't do Thanksgiving over here, so. Oh, is this their version of, you know, the ham, the baked ham with the pineapple rings? I love the cheese singles on the fucking mac and cheese back there. <laughs> it looks, it's an interesting meal. I know, you're getting this thing out fast, and you were stressed out. It came out fast. She didn't cook anything. All she did was dump cans into foil trays. She didn't cook. She hasn't cooked anything. Oh my god. Look at that. 
You know what? I don't mind cooked pineapple. Only on pizza, though. I am one of those people that likes pineapple on pizza. So I, I'm sorry to all your pineapple haters, but I like pineapple on a pizza. I don't like everybody else makes theirs. That's how I make mine. Is this green bean casserole? Okay. Oh, we got the walnut cheese. I recognize that packet. <laughs> what is that? Is that is that supposed to be bacon bits? Pineapple pizza with bacon and jalapenos. I mean, maybe. I normally just get a Hawaiian, so it's like ham, pineapple. Uh, over here, you can get it with egg on top as well. So they like crack a couple of eggs on top before they bake the pizza. And it's really good. Okay. So, sweet and a bit sassy baked. Are they Dr. fucking Pepper beans? What? What? Dr. Pepper do beans? Guys, when was someone going to tell me that Dr. Pepper do fucking baked beans? <laughs> <laughs> what, they're expanding their fucking product lines now? <laughs> What'd you say? It's browning. What you want? It's browning. No, that, that shit's still pale as fuck. Okay. You need to add color to that turkey. God. Yeah. Usually you don't do that. What is that? Oh, is this supposed to be the sweet potato casserole? That's not enough marshmallow. Yeah. So you, oh, so we just made this in advance. You're not gonna cook it right now. No, we gotta cook it tomorrow. I thought you were gonna cook it. Wait, why are you? Wait. If you're gonna cook it tomorrow, everything was in can. You literally did all this prep so quickly. You didn't need to. It's not even for today. She prepped tinned ingredients the day before. <laughs> How time poor are you? Oh, she didn't realize. Oh, no. God. Uh, why is there... I just noticed, but why is there a hairbrush in the middle of her food prepping? Can anyone explain the hairbrush? Why, why is there a hairbrush? And, like... Are they banana peppers? It looks like she's using banana peppers like our friend over at Not Sure What's Cooking. Like, they look like the same fucking banana peppers we saw before. Well, that was... Uh, that, that one's pickles? Okay, my bad. Ham and collards, her... Alright, let's see what else we have here I saw the beanie weenies but I also I've, I've seen this concerning ass shepherd's pie and I need to know what the fuck is on like because that doesn't look like potato because that didn't look like potato on top of that shepherd's pie like, I don't know what that was, but it didn't look like potato. Good lord. That's a big thing of hamburger meat. I'm good. Jamaica, thank you for gifting a tier one sub. Not at all. So what are we making? I've just realized I haven't put the... Oh! Oh, hey! She's straining it! Oh, no. 
She just spilt it, but look! Look, someone is straining the grease, guys! Holla fucking Luya! Someone is finally removing the mints, removing the fat from the mints. Not once have I seen any of these goddamn women do that. <laughs> Sweet peas. Ah, uh, tinned peas always look so sad. My mum... So, we used to have... Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I just noticed that. They are cute. Um growing up uh in the summertime here because it's so damn hot my mum would do like cold meat and salads a lot of nights for dinner so it would just be like you know shaved ham and uh stuff like that or like chicken loaf and and stuff um but she would always also have like a goddamn tin of peas like tinned peas to put on your plate as well so you'd have like beetroot peas corn all that shit on your on your plate i never once liked those fucking canned peas frozen peas are so much better than those canned ones oh that's why the potato looks funky it's that it's the powder Oh. oh, powdered mash. Have we ever had this flavor before? No. Wait, did she say they're ranch mashed potatoes? Did she just say ranch flavored mashed potato? America, you've gone too far. Stop. You know not what you do. Why have you made ranch flavored mashed potatoes? Hey, hey, Soy. Yeah, you're late, but late's be better late than never, right? Uh, it's also you know you you're not missing a whole lot. There's no badgie today. It's just me. We are discovering Josh and Mama. And she's not quite at K level, but she's something. Oh. Now, I've used powdered mashed potato. And it's okay. Like, you can get nice... You can get nice powdered mash. Like... If you don't have any potatoes or you want to do it really quickly, sometimes powdered mash works. That doesn't look right. That looks floury. <laughs> it is nice and peaceful here today. It what are you It doesn't look right. Also, that I think you needed more mash. Dang. Hold on. Yeah, it's potato. Pa she does. She needed to make more mash for one, because that's not enough mashed potato for a shepherd's pie. And <laughs> Dramecca, thank you for gifting a tier one sub. It's also like one of the top known carcinogens. Still so wow. Go America, I guess. I mean, I know you, you can buy powdered mash here. I don't know if it's got the same ingredients, but. Uh, I used to live with my ex's family and the mum loved to use powdered mashed potato. And it was, mo it was fine for the most part. Mm, tasted fine. Dang, was we running low? This I can't forgive. I know you have shredded fucking cheese in your house, woman. I've seen the bags. Why are you using cheese singles? They don't even melt properly. 
<laughs> Why are you using cheese singles on a shepherd's pie? I don't like it. Go on sleep or something. You didn't even. What do you want from rent? You didn't even want to rent. Rents you. <laughs> Oh, look at it. Oh, it looks so sad. <laughs> Elric. Oi. Would you eat that, buddy? No? Yeah, me neither. It looks like depression food. Oh, the side view is even worse. There's just this sad little bit of mince in the bottom. She probably could have put it in a smaller dish, actually. She didn't really have enough filling to spread it out in that casserole dish well. I would have put it in a, a smaller dish and then you can have like a larger, like nice chunk of shepherd's pie. Oh, oh that's a good way to portion it off. Everybody gets a cheese Everybody pie. gets a square. Right. Yeah, but you cut in the middle of the square. You didn't. You excited about your powdered taties? Those potatoes are so good. Really? Are oh they? Your face said they weren't. That made a difference. Where are the people? Well, I mean, it's kind of late in, in uh, you know, most places. Also, you know, we don't have the badgie and... Uh, was the only seasoning the ranch potatoes? Uh, I don't think she added. Did she add any seasoning to the mince? No, I don't think she did. So yeah, the only seasoning is the ranch. Just the yummy, yummy ranch and those craft singles. <laughs> no, it's quieter today because we don't have Badger hyping everybody up. Being the uh, the feral cursed entity that he is, but that's nice on occasion, right? We can chill out. We can just uh, we can have nice times and not and uh, not get murdered. We only need badge for oh, jarlic. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, oh, dancing. <laughs> Are they? How much? Blink twice if you're being held hostage, Josh. Blink twice. I know you made them better, make them put them in this. No, I didn't want to hit that. God damn it! I love it, and then we just have a shepherd's pie done right here. <laughs> oh, guys, this lady. I. I mean, yeah, again, not as bad as Kay, but I think she used more more processed foods than the crockpot ladies. Oh my god, do we have anything with her making anything in a crockpot? You can buy octopus at Walmart? Should you buy octopus at Walmart? I wonder if that is a wise to sit. Should you buy snails at Walmart? There's a good question. I feel like if you're buying sna edible snails at Walmart, that's a bad decision. The shrimp tacos? Oh no. Oh. I mean, these don't look that bad. How can you fuck up like three ingredients? It's literally just looks like shrimp, uh, a tortilla, and lettuce. And she's cooking already cooked sh shrimp. Hey, Menace, happy to see you're still around. We've moved on to Josh and Mama.
Sounds like a heart attack in the making. Ugh. My internet is going to be the death of me today. Yeah, is it just me or is she, uh, she boil and froze? Oh, oh yeah, look at that shrimpsicle. That's a shrimpsicle, that is. Oh, she's got the little fucking taco holders. Uh, what is that? Mayonnaise? She's putting mayonnaise on that tortilla. Does it? Yeah, she's literally just going to have mayonnaise, lettuce, shrimp. You could have put a sauce on there. Why didn't you just put a sauce on there? They look pr they look pretty bland. That's what they look like. Oh no, you put cheese on there. Okay. You, you, you is everything See, she has shredded cheese. So why why did if she always has shredded cheese, why did she put fucking cheese singles on the goddamn shepherd's pie? There's no salsa. No. Yeah. Well, mayonnaise is about the only fucking seasoning you've got on there. You adding more mayonnaise? Are you just substituting for sour cream? No, what? Why are you sub? You could substitute mayonnaise for sour cream. I'm sure you can, but why not just put some sour cream and some salsa on there? Come on, please. Like, I don't, like, I know, I know poor people can make better tacos than this shit. Oh, no, stop it. Again, with the browser lag, it's, it's not talking to me. Computer is saying no. You met, now you knew I was going to be, you knew what stream you were walking into. Dramaker. Why did you think you could eat safely? <laughs> you knew what was going to happen. These are... Uh, a weirdly different level. Yeah, that is true. Dare a two-ingredient mac macaroni pie... Makes her famous pineapples, mayonnaise, and cheese? Oh no, that scotch egg doesn't look cooked. Oh, that scotch egg looks raw in the middle. Oh no. Did you not cook your egg properly, Mama? Come on, YouTube. Yeah, mayo is apparently the pinnacle of all seasonings. And Chrome is having a shit fit. Ah, uh, yeah, basically. Had to cough. Yeah, there is none. So a lot of diet mayos actually end up having no egg in them, which is why uh, when I was vegan, I used to eat a lot of uh, low-fat mayonnaise because that shit didn't have egg in it, and it was cheaper than buying like the vegan branded mayonnaise uh, because it wasn't labeled vegan, so they didn't put the price up to like you know twice of what regular mayo would be.
but apparently she's making scotch eggs and the thumbnail has me concerned because it looked raw. Well, I'm trying a new international recipe. I want to try some different stuff. You need it first. An international recipe. The scotch <laughs> egg. <laughs> Eggs and oh my god, you that egg, stop! The egg is dead. What are you doing? Oh my god, you've murdered that egg. That egg is squishied. Oh no. See, we needed Badgie here. We needed the Scottish man here for these Scotch eggs. I think you might have the heat too high there, lady. All right, guys, make a note. We have to show this to Badgie next week. If it turns out good. That is so easy. That was crunchy. That looks burnt. Also, scotch egg normally has, like, breading. Like, it has, like, a... Like, a breading outside. Like, it's supposed to have, like, breadcrumbs or something on it. Because you burnt the fuck out of the outside. Was it this hard? No. Can you taste it? No, don't eat it. It's raw. Uh, don't eat it. Don't. No. No, the sausage is raw. No. Put them in the oven. No, look at it. <laughs> Just put them in the oven. No, I hate this. And it exploded. It fucking exploded. <laughs> She fucking exploded the egg in the microwave. I mean, yeah, she did, but... The sausage is done now. She just blew up a scotch egg in her microwave. Hey, everybody, so it is recipe... She... She blew up a fucking scotch egg. Yeah, we do need to show her. Becretary has made a note for us, guys, so that we can, uh, we can torment the badger. Well, I, I guess we, we'll have to return to Josh and Mama again in the future, I think. Uh, because... Uh, Christ. You think Kay's cooking does scotch eggs? She does. What is this? Come on. Come on, YouTube. Come on. Why is my browser like this? Oh my god. Oh, good news, guys. She did three years ago something she's just called Mexican food. <laughs> it just says the title is just Mexican food. It doesn't. What is it? Shall we click it? Shall we see what Kay's version of Mexican food is? <laughs> it literally just says Mexican food. Um, so I have no idea. I don't know what's happening. Um... All right, guys, I'm just going to go grab a drink because this coffee is cold and it's and I want to drink something that isn't cold coffee. But I'll be back in like one minute.
I did use soy milk. That's all I have in my house. I don't have regular milk. I started drinking it when I was vegan, but I kept I kept it up even after I stopped being vegan because I like the taste of soy milk. So, oh, and we're counting the alphabet now, are we, soy? Oh, nine O. Oh. I don't remember nine being a letter in the alphabet, soy. <laughs> I haven't tried pea protein milk. I've tried pea protein and it is nasty. Ah. <laughs> uh, you switched from soy see i i like soy some people have a thing where they can't have uh can't have uh the you know the um the stuff in soy or they're allergic to soy that's fine i've tried i don't mind almond milk for coffees but i don't like almond milk in like cereal and stuff the consistency isn't as nice um I find soy milk, because it's a bit thicker, tends to be nicer to use in cereal and cooking and things. Oat milk is way too fucking watery, uh, as is coconut milk. Um, well, hello. Hello, little. How you doing? Oh, oh ittel. My bad. My brain read that as little, but it is ittel. Uh, I have my drink. Got uh, got my Coca Cola diet though because I'm a little bitch who doesn't like regular Coke. And we have some K's motherfucking cooking. Oh, it's supposed to be little. <laughs> diet Coke is the best Coke, Bex. Everyone is like Coke Zero, Coke Zero, and I just like, I like the taste of Diet Coke. They used to do, do you guys remember when they used to do Diet Coke with a, with a hint of lime? Oh, orbs. You don't want Diet Coke? What if, what if I came over there and served you Diet Coke, orbs? Would you say no to me? Arizona tea is really sweet. I, I can't drink any of those super sweet drinks. I like anything that's like crazy sugary. You wouldn't you wouldn't drink Diet Coke for me, Orbs? That's a shame. Yeah, but so does vodka. Vodka works with any energy drinks as well. <laughs> or um, take Red Bull and Contro and you know how you do a Jaeger bomb? Well, if you substitute the Jaeger for Contro, you get a Skittle bomb and it it tastes exactly like Skittles. Like, highly recommend. When I was uh, 18... And first, because you can drink at 18 over here. Um. <laughs> yeah, so when I got back from a bar, I've been drinking Diet Coke and vodka all night. Hey, that's a good combo. You know what else is good? Rum and orange juice. If you just want to keep it simple, rum and, rum and orange juice is, is nice as well. Um, but yeah, when I turned 18 and could drink legally here, whenever we went to like the pub or the bars and stuff, we'd order, we'd always order like 
Skittle bombs because they're tasty. And I'm not a huge fan of Jaeger, but it's not too bad. But anyway, we have, uh, do we have any Mexican food specialists in, in the chat today? Because Kay is cooking something she likes to call Mexican food. Ah, yeah, orbs, I feel that. I usually just drink beer, but, like, if I'm going out for the night, I'll have a few cocktails, or, uh, um, I have a bottle of uh, peanut butter whiskey in my cupboard right now, which is really nice. Like, I can drink that straight. I yeah, her cooking is terrible, little. That's why we're here. We're here to watch her make... I don't know what she's considering Mexican food, but here we are. We're witnessing Kay's Mexican food. You're allergic to peanut butter. Oh. Screwballs are good, yeah. You're waiting for your McDonald's? Oh, why do all y'all insist on eating? Whenever you come to this stream, you know what you're getting into. It's not like I surprise you guys every time with what with the content we we put on. And yet you all still try and eat. <laughs> uh, you're a bit drunk. Well, that'll probably help you eat, I would say. Uh, just a reminder, if anyone has joined this stream uh, recently... You have a shakuchi board. <laughs> we are still doing the sub goal. Uh, once we hit 100 subs, Badger has to eat uh, eat a spoonful of jarred garlic, which I'm sure he's going to absolutely hate. Uh, so help us get towards that sub goal so that we can make Badger eat garlic. Uh, sub if you can. Make sure you're you're following if if not, and uh, spread the word about our React streams because we have a lot of fun doing this with you every week, and it's kind of like a highlight for me to be honest. No, he hates Jarlik. He absolutely hates Jarlik. Jarlik, you're what orbs? Hmm. Why don't you finish your sentence, huh? Oh, and I'm back cooking again. And today okay. I'm going to do Mexican food in tacos. Me Mexican food in tacos. Mexican food in tacos. What is the Mexican food she is putting in her taco? I wonder. <sighs> Skin off first. We don't know. See, yes, tacos does sound safe. However, she didn't just say tacos. She said she's putting Mexican food in tacos. Does she not understand that tacos are Mexican? Like... Oh, yeah. Oh, she uses fresh ingredients, Orbs. That's not the problem with K. Well, I feel a bit better with, with this now. It's not what I did shiny ones, as you can see. It's one of the other ones. I was, too, I was just too scared to use the other ones. What? So I'm just going to take some layers of skin off this one. Too scared to use the onion? What was wrong with the onion? What happened? I have trouble with an onion. It's uh, you don't need layers of skin to take off. You don't know where you are. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this layer of skin off. This well, she peels onions skin. worse than I do. Another layer. Oh my God! No, stop! What are, what are you doing? This. This bit. Oh this God! This is painful. So when, you know you're in for it, it when she off. can't, when she can't even peel an onion, like. Kay, what have you done? I'll leave any on. 
What have you done to this onion? Okay, that you're removing layers of onion. What is that? Look at all that onion you're peeling off. That is so much onion. <laughs> well, goodbye. On a yarn. What? It's going dull, is it, Kay? I'm going to slice this up. On yarn. Oh God, Kay, your fingers, Kay. Please, oh. Shit. Yeah, yeah. You were right to worry, Bex. Oh, well, we've got it. We've done it. We thought we would do. We thought it would be long. So what How? I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. What are you gonna? Are you gonna finish cutting? Are you gonna finish cutting the onion? No, look, the rest of the onion. You didn't finish cutting the onion. Kay. Right, I've stopped bleeding now, so I'm gonna. What? Oh, this. good news, guys. She stopped bleeding now, but she didn't put a band aid on. She she didn't band aid or anything, so uh, you get some tasty K blood in your Mexican food in your taco. Pepper up. It's a red bell pepper. Uh, K. K, I think your bell pepper's moldy. Bell pepper's not supposed to be that colour on the inside, K. Look at this. Your bell pepper went bad. You can't eat that, K. Look! Look at that. Oh no, fresh yesterday. So we're gonna slice that in. Don't say fresh yet. You're not using that, right, Kay? Please, please tell me you're not using and that. That's a small knife again. No. Now, this is more sharper. Please watch your hands. The other one. I am so frightened. So that's I'm putting these in. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these in with the onion honey arms. The uh, onions. onions. Uh with the honey arms to Wait, she's together. why is she saying honey arms now? What it what joke are we not getting? So then I'm gonna put it should I think there's a sauce I've got to <laughs> but we do some form a little bit. So to make the honey stuff. Right, as you can see I'm doing the uh... Oh, you cooked the fuck out of that honey yarn, didn't you? You made them charred honey yarns. I don't know. Wait, what is that? What is that sauce she's got in the the pan what's what's in that sauce bit? Some sauce, some spicy sauce. So, I'm going to add... Uh, what is in there? The... Chicky yarn in. The chicky yarn? That's it, and... Yeah, some sort of spicy sauce. She didn't say what it was. It just says some sort of spicy sauce that she's adding her chimkin to. And I'm assuming that she'll serve it with her honey yarns and furry pepper. Stir that in the uh, sauce. But we don't. What is in the sauce, Kay? You gonna tell us what the sauce is? Spicy ketchup. Right now, I'm gonna. Oh, you're not even gonna use an actual taco. You're using those fucking taco boats. Is she trying to make mole? No, she would. She just said spicy sauce. She, if she was, if she made mole, she would have mentioned it had like chocolate and shit in it. But yeah, she's using taco boats. Put the. Now you can uh, you can make this with chicken or or ch uh, or mince meat. Chicken My or mince. Says she's not bothered what she what she has it done with. 
my friend, did you get this recipe off someone? Okay. Is this someone else's fucking recipe? What? Is that spreading it out? That's not spreading it out. What are you doing? Are you... The onions. Why are you not filling the other part of the boat? Peppers. I know these are red peppers, but they're not spicy at all. Yeah, no, that's because they're capsicum. It's capsicum. In there, like that. Oops, it's, it's a, a fell over. It's a fucking I? bell pepper. They're not spicy, no. I'm put the sauce. I'm going to get a different spoon. I'm Why are you getting a different spoon? Put sauce and put some off. Oh, you're going to put more so more of that fucking sauce right, on top, are you? This is warmed up enough, I'm hoping. And, uh, Wait, is she using a different sauce I'm for the put top? This sauce. Is that a different sauce to the... Oh, yeah, that looks like salsa. Oh, ran out of sauce. <laughs> you ran out of sauce? Not to worry. Why are you putting that much off. sauce Ooh. on there? What is... Lee is coming to do... Oh my god, it doesn't even look like a cheap taco. Like, what is this? Lee is coming to do... <laughs> oh god, I've got them off. Hi, Lee. Eat your honey onions. And your peppers. And your spicy fucking sauce. Oh, God, that sauce is going to be red hot. <laughs> look at the face she's making. She's making him eat this, and look at her goddamn face. <laughs> Kay, you made this creation. You shouldn't be looking like that. Look at the, the face. Look at this. Why does she look like that? <laughs> oh. It's not. Is it? No, it's not. Oh, well, I'm still not having it anyway. I'm not going to take a chance. I'm not going to be bad, bad all night. What? You're not going to eat it, Kay? You cooked it. You cooked it. Why are you not going to eat any of it? That is delicious. Is it? Gorgeous. Oh, that's it. Is it? That's <laughs> why I it. It takes a while, thank you. Oh, what you're not touching it because it's too it. spicy? It has yeah, nothing to do with the... That's the weird fucking me. furry bell pepper and well, yeah, everything else that went into that. Oh, that's nice. I'm about to go yeah. throw up off camera. Right, Lee likes it. I'm glad to hear that. Um, I know I've only shown you one. Uh, reason is, is I'm not going to be having the sauce on my chicken. I, don't, I, can't, I can't see the point in being ill all night. So, if you like what you see... But I'm going to feed it to my son. <laughs> he can stay up on the shitter all night. All right. So I'm disappointed in how that is. How is that? How was that Mexican food? Apart from the fact that it was served in a fucking taco boat. And it looked like she heated up salsa to put on top. It looked like one of those, you know, when you get like, the the packets in the supermarket that have like the tortillas and the salsa and the seasoning packet all in one that sauce looked like the salsa that you get in the little foil packet that you're supposed to drizzle on top at the end yeah that's what that salt i think that's what that salsa was that's why she ran out so fucking quick because there's only like it's only supposed to be drizzled on top. That chicken was swimming in it. <laughs> oh. Oh god. The worst part is we now get to look at her make a scotch egg, which I know is going to be terrifying because I'm looking at it here and then it doesn't look anything like a scotch egg. <laughs> People and oh. Can we have something that doesn't look like it's running on a potato? No, we can't. Okay. There we go. Who has the worst scotch egg? I mean, 
K wins if K's is cooked because Mama's was fucking raw. So a scotch egg is basically you take like a boiled egg, a hard boiled egg, you wrap mints around it, like sausage mints around it, then you uh, bread it and then you fry it like in a, in a, in a fry pan. It's just like it's mince egg in a breaded coating. It's just a ball of nom. Uh, and they can be nice. If they're cooked and seasoned well, they're great. I don't think that's going to happen today, though. Don't think that's happening today. I'm going to put the subtitles on, even though they struggle to understand a word K says. Hi, people, and I'm back cooking again. And today I'm going to do a double. I'm going to do scotch eggs and sausage rolls. Let me know if the volume's okay, guys. Because I just don't want to blow my eardrums I out. Say, I've got my paste roll. I didn't show you my paste roll in there. Because for simple reason, I've lost, for, so, again, I have lost my rolling pin. My rolling pin, it seems to lie. You never have a fucking small, rolling pin when you need to roll something. It seems to lie, disappear. Oh, what is that? Word, well, this come out, right. Is that sausage mince? Sausage meat. That's your sausage. No, it ain't. <laughs> Get in it. Ain't your sausage roll. Right, I am going that. Mmm, sausage meat. I don't like it. The thing is about sausage rolls, I make them every time round about Christmas time. And the problem I have. <laughs> the rolling. I'm willing to bet she never had one at all. <laughs> And my sausage rolls come open, don't they, Lee? Or are you always too drunk to know? <laughs> no. I don't even drink. <laughs> Did she just I sass her fucking cameraman? I didn't, I didn't really miss them. I know you made scotch eggs, but I can't remember your sausage rolls. I made scotch eggs at Christmas time. No, I know it's at Christmas time, so I remember you making scotch eggs. I can't remember you making sausage rolls. You made scotch eggs with me? Mm-hmm. That was funny. She just... That was funny. <laughs> Yeah, well, I mean, she was calling her son drunk, who apparently doesn't even drink. Uh, but yeah, yeah, she's calling you out now, little. Also, Menace, good job on not making them cry. Horny is always nice, though. Right, I'm rolling, I don't know if you can see, but I'm rolling this. What are you doing? Why are you rolling it in your hands oh, like that? You could have rolled it on the pastry. Also, you don't even need to roll it, by the way. You can just sort of like smush it down. It doesn't need to be rolled. Like she's just making sausage rolls. I don't know if you guys have ever made sausage rolls, but you, I never did this making sausage rolls. Like that. What have you done? What it looks like a minced turd. It just looks like right, someone took a yeah. big old pink shit <laughs> on some pastry. Now I'm going to, oh, this is going to be fun. I'm going to fold it over. Wait, are you using I'm all that pastry? You don't need that much pastry for what? Oh, oh my God, that'd fun. make at least two. I mean, it folded over. She only needed about half that pastry. And I'm going to fold it over again like this side. And I'm going to pick it up. No, that's too corners, much pastry. The the corners. Oh, no. look at that. <laughs> no. This thing is all These pastry. Making tray. So what we're going to do is put it corner to corner. Why don't you cut it? Oh, better. And then I'm going to make the, he the eggs. The scotch eggs. Oh, are you putting them all on the same? Of course you're putting them all on the same it. tray. <clears throat> Look, you See? didn't even shape it properly, Kay. My hand. <laughs> she I hasn't even made, done the ends. I've, made, I've, made <laughs> I've um, boiled two eggs. I keep hearing about Greg's That's sausage rolls. Sausage me, uh, yeah, again, n no seasonings at all. Just this weird fucking cat, cat food of a sausage mince. Someone pinched it while I was asleep last night. Oh. Right, that's the. Oh. Sausage. 
excuse me, out. Guys, I... Yeah, that, it just looks... I think I will order a new voice for Christmas. But this one is a bit bad for a witch. Back in the drawing room, just put that in the bin, please. Put that. In the bin. Oh, good. Now, how yeah, is she going to put this mince around her scotch egg? Flatten the sausage meat out. Ah. Actually, I'm gonna put them oh, oh yeah, but they're covered in flour now, Kay, so they're not gonna fucking gonna stick to shit. Tear, we don't want them to... <sighs> it's not even gonna... She can't even mix it together properly now because it's covered in flour. Oh, no. oh but now it's all stuck to the board. To... Honest, I am going back home, I've had enough. I've got to move out. Help, guys. Help me. Oh, why are you coating it in flour like that? That is so much flour. Kay, please stop. As I said, yeah. my rolling pin has gone. Yeah, she, she doesn't have a fucking rolling pin, but she is going to drown it in flour. Then I'm going to... You've got to make sure, by the way, I've boiled these eggs for 10 minutes. I would I would advise you to make sure that they are cold before you put them. You're not going to... Kay, there's too much flour. You're not going to be able to... I'm, I'm surprised sure that meat has any egg. stick to it anymore. The amount of flour that she has wait. mixed into that sausage mince. <laughs> Right, I'm going to cut some. Yeah, she excess. made meat dough. That's what she made. Meat That's just meat mm. dough. Look at all of the flour. <laughs> sure oh. Meat is all around the egg. Fucking save me, guys, please. Oh, and now she's about to dump the whole fucking thing no. in egg. Oh, it's See what I mean? Why is it always do it to me? Because you covered it in flour. Ah, that looks of course it can't stick to anything. Can you get me a plate, please? I've got to get a plate out. <laughs> oh, small. How is that? holding together at all. There is so... I mean, we are... I'm sure Badge has seen this Kay's cooking one. I'm fairly certain he wouldn't have seen that Josh and Mama one. So, we're definitely showing him the Josh and Mama one. I mean, um, she's going to, through more... Yeah, see? Breadcrumbs. A scotch egg yeah, has breadcrumbs on the outside. Mama didn't bother to put any fucking breadcrumbs on her scotch egg. It was just meat and egg. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. I do not like this. I always think it's disgusting. It's disgusting. Disgusting. I'm going to roll in some red crumbs. Oh, God. Mmm. Eggy goodness. Yeah, sad critter noises indeed. That's one. That's sand from the back. No, it's bread crumbs. It's the sand. Oh no! It's the fucking sand from that movie. You know what? I wouldn't be surprised if it came to fucking life and ate somebody. Uh, for those that aren't part of it already, uh, join the Patreon uh, and uh, we do fun little bad horror movie streams there pretty regularly. Uh, Bex has just linked my card there. You can find my Patreon through it. Uh, 
for as little as it's like three dollars Australian yeah, a month, which is like less again if you're doing American dollars or pounds. Uh, um, that'll get you yeah, to yes. the Discord. Um, and we do trash horror movie streams and all sorts of fun stuff over there. Uh, gotta see. Hi. Uh, I also do live uh, recordings for some of my audios as well. And we have a lot of fun there. It's a, it's a fun little place to hang out in the borough. There is a no look yeah, I, I adore trash mm. horror movies. I adore sharing trash horror movies with other people. Uh, and we also watch a lot of stuff like this, and we watch some other streamers. Badge occasionally makes an appearance as well. Uh, but it's a, it's well worth, I think, the couple of dollars you pay to get access. Uh, you also get early access to all my YouTube audios as well. Oh, yeah, The Descent is really good. Yeah, Descent, Descent is good. The second one awful don't bother watching the sequel they they said what if we just completely threw out the ending of the original and uh made another movie <laughs> that's what they did with number two it's not worth it yeah uh i haven't seen saltburn i've been hearing about it it's something it's on my list and actually this isn't related to Kay at all. Uh, now we're just talking shit horror movies. But has anyone seen that? What is it called? I think it's called Night Swim. That horror movie about something in a pool killing people. It's just it's just come out. I think it's called Night Swim. Um, the Descent technically has two endings, Curly, because there's the original ending that the first movie gave us. And then they were like, ah, but this movie made lots of money, so let's make a sequel. But how do we make a sequel? Let's fucking just forget the original ending and make a new one. <laughs> so, yeah, First Descent, really good. Sharknado, Shark, I mean, it's scary, but but not for, for those reasons. Uh... What we watched the other day, though, we watched uh, we watched a movie called Monster Grizzly, uh, which was we watched uh, we watched it off Tubi, good old Tubi TV and their trashy horror me- horror stuff. Um, it had I think we counted it had twenty four fade to black transitions in the movie twenty four. Yeah. It was really bad. And they only had like, it seems like they only bought like one monster bear animation because it was a CGI bear. And they just showed the same few frames of the monster bear animation whenever they needed to show the bear killing somebody. And that's the only time you ever saw the bear was when it was about to kill somebody because they they couldn't afford to get more frames of animation. <laughs> Jeepers Creepers is really good too. Uh, two scotch. I mean, guys, it's really just a dick and balls, isn't it? She's just made a dick and balls. <laughs> oh, watch me get demonetized on YouTube. They am in the oven for twenty minutes, and I am going to cook them on two hundred. For 20 minutes, like I just said. 200 for 20 minutes if you guys are making this at home. I've got to glaze the... That, okay, that's not how you glaze. You are not just going to... You are not just pouring that raw egg straight on the sausage roll. That's not how you glaze. (laughs) Twig and two berries. Thanks, Orbs. I would like to point out her glazing technique is let's just... Pour the fa- oh n- No, okay. No, no. Why, hello, touch. Oh, why? There we are now. It's classed as glazed. That's not fucking glazed. You just made it swimming in fucking egg. 
Oh, also, Touch, she's making scotch eggs. What do you think of her scotch eggs? <laughs> it isn't. It's just had eggs poured all over it, but it's classed as glazed. That and is I not... We're not classing that as glazed. I'm sorry. It. No. You can see... What the fuck is this? What happened to the scotch egg? It's giving birth. The scotch egg in the bottom right is giving birth. Uh, the sausage roll. Uh, the sausage roll is uh, shedding its skin in terror. Well, no, touch. She's making scotch eggs and, and sausage roll. And I don't know how she managed to make the sausage roll. Oh, that's the glaze. Oh, I know why it looks like that. Because she just poured whole fucking egg on there. Because her glaze is just not even properly stirred egg wash. It's all come out. All done. They look nice. They look nice. That look nice. That look really nice. Uh, I'm going to leave it to cool down a bit. Nothing looks nice. To burn his mouth. But I know you'd like to see it on camera. But that's just being cruel. So I'm going to leave it to cool down a bit. And then I'm going to let Lee taste. It would be cruel to let him burn himself on this hot food, but not too cruel to let him eat this food. This is the end product of sausage rolls and scotch. Look at the fucking end of that sausage roll. Because she didn't fold the pastry. She just kind of rolled it and left yes. it. It's still a bit hot, but Lee's decided... Good job, cameraman. He's a brave lad. <laughs> Can we see inside the scotch egg, please? Can you cut into the scotch egg? I need to see inside the egg. Where have you run? Take a bit now. What more time you take? Egg. It looks like it... Oh, yes, it does. It does indeed. Of course it's going to be as good as it was in. I want to see inside the cut egg. That's half the fun of the scotch egg, when you cut it in half and you see the different layers. Taste. No, her, his taste buds. I mean, I don't have any taste buds left anymore because I burnt them all out, but you know. I, yeah, it, it's rolled over because you used far too much pastry for the amount of meat you put in there. She did, yeah. She was like, no, it's not burnt. <laughs> Again, what is... Kay, what is this face you're pulling? Why are you pulling this face? Like, you're not sure he should be eating it. <laughs> She is so concerned right now. Just, just look at her face. Brilliant. I mean, I don't know who is filming it right now or whether they have it on a stand because I think Lee normally records. They are, they're both nice. They both are gorgeous. I'm not going to taste that. Gorgeous? That's, 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 that's not that's how that's I would describe Kay's cooking. Really no, before you start giving me that nasty look... Right. It's because they were really hot and burning in this. I didn't really, I couldn't really get a taste. Why have we got this? Yeah, yeah. yeah, what the fuck is the camera doing? It's kind of just going, woo. We're going, are we going into a dream sequence? Are we yeah, about to transition? Taste, he actually did taste like it, but it was really, will you stop looking at me like that? <laughs> it, 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 like I said, only thing I could really taste was hotness. Mm. But All I could taste is hotness. Like yes. Oh. Good job, Lee. It's good. Very good. I hope that gave you a rough idea of how to make a sausage roll and scotch egg. It's but still I fucking said, doing it. Lee said they, they taste all right, obviously. Yours will turn out, obviously, a lot better than mine. If you like what you see, please keep viewing me. Tell other people who aren't viewing me to get viewing me. If you like what you see, give me a big old thumbs up. If you want to leave me a comment, people... Please feel free. Apologize if anyone gets motion sick from that goddamn camera. People 
or haven't subscribed, tell, tell them to get subscribing. Thank you. Bye. I love Kay. Kay is a... Well, I mean, apart from the fact that Kay may or may not have tried to scam Badger out of some money, uh, if you want to know more about that, go back to uh, one of the uh, stream recaps on YouTube. I think it's like our very first stream that I put in the playlist. And he talks about the time that uh, Kay tried to scam him out of five pounds. <laughs> uh, that... Oh, God, she makes beef Wellington. Oh, I gotta see this. Oh. Active of an invite cooking at King. And today... Kay, are you sick? You seem unwell. Is it just me or does she seem really unwell there? <laughs> I'm going to be... Having a go at making beef wellington, which I'm not looking forward to. As you can see, I've got some fresh mushrooms, freshly bought this morning. Are you okay, Kay? And oh God, don't hold the knife like that, Jesus. That knife was far too close to your face. Bridge, which have made him a bit of a funny colour. Ah, oh, she had the mushrooms in the fridge. This. Okay. I'm going to cut these, all these mushrooms up until, it, until they look like breadcrumbs. Oh, you're going to until mince I'm them? Anyway. Kay, do you own a fruit processor? All I'm willing to bet you make enough just... money off YouTube to buy a food processor, Kay. I'm trying to cut in my hand. Uh. So what are you doing? As you can see, oh my god, like look at crumbs. it. Can't cut them anymore. Oh and my there's god. There's a lot more mushrooms there. But yes, I will be cutting some more up. Why? Um, and putting them in the pan. Right, as you can see, I've oh. got the... Now we've got mushrooms in a pan. She has a new pan now. We're watching a newer episode. She's gotten rid of that old metal pan she had. That one still has its non-stick coating. A bit of garlic. Now a lot of you have said, you don't get brown garlic. You do if you've got lazy garlic. Now that to me looks brown. Gray, not gray, I mean, brown. yeah, I mean, it's brown garlic because it's it's pre minced garlic. Yeah, it's the garlic, guys. Soon, this is a good time to plug the subathon that we're currently having. Please, guys, if you can, please throw some subs our way because when we get to a hundred subs, Badger has to eat garlic. <laughs> Right here on stream. Where are we at? I think we're at 53 right now. We're like halfway. We're about halfway. Teaspoon of garlic. Well, actually, it says a very... Oh, can't see it. Very lazy chopped garlic. I need that. I need that brand of garlic. That's me. So I'm going to mix this round on a little heat. Have you got a fucking chopping, plastic chopping board and shit on your stove top, Kay? What are you doing? Hey, thanks, bunny. Oh, there we go. 57. Thank you for gifting a tier one sub. And you can probably see... In the rest of the camera shot. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Please come tell here. me you. Why have you got that cutting now, board? If you're why it looks like that, thinking, well, hold on, that looks like it's been cooked, 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 cooked. Have you this cooked? This has been cooked because I don't like my stuff on my plate going moo or whatever. You've pre cooked like the meat for the it. Wellington? Right. So I have cooked it in oil. And in some seasoning. Wait, no, no. She pre-cooked her beef? It's still got to go back in the oven. 
How are you making a Wellington with that? Yeah, that's the wrong, it's the wrong cut. It's already like well done. So it's going to end up dry as shit by the time you, you cook it inside the pastry. Like, oh God. Well, you thought it was a piece of chocolate, chocolate cake? cake. No, oh, it's geez, not. <laughs> so, uh, so yes, I'm going to put some salt and pepper in it. I will be using this small dish. What? Okay, you don't need to. You don't. Really you, don't need to do you don't need to do this. You don't need to do this. I will be making a small one in this small dish. It looks big on. Camera. You know what? I I need I need my emotional support animal. I need something to hold. <laughs> oh, okay. No, no, I'm not going to disturb Elric. I have this guy. This is Bazza. He can be our badger stand-in. Believe me, it's only small. But yes, I will be putting it in there when the mushrooms have come together. Right, as you can see, I've got my bowl. Yeah. I've got my eight ounces of flour. Yeah. Bazza says hi. Two ounces of lard and two ounces of marge. And a pinch of salt. So we got lard, so margarine, salt, into flour, breadcrumbs. Because it does say to add three tablespoons of water I think that's gonna need a lot more than that but well you're making a dough so three tablespoons of water First. I think she's making like a, a short crust sort of pastry and this done yeah it's more like a both hands but when one of your hands is hurting like a you yeah a short crust them. Look like a it, pie, sort of, a pie style pastry dough. So, yeah. Uh, I don't know if I told you, eight ounces of flour, two ounces of lard, two ounces of mar uh, marge, two ounces of butter. Yes, I only use, uh, I only use marge on bread now. Use butter for cooking. Oh, oh, she does yeah, use butter for cooking. Everything's expensive to buy. Everything is in expensive, so, Kay. I get you. That's nearly done. Cost that's of living. It's it. not making things easy. A few more lumps in it. Get them out. Can you, you can see, can't you? Yeah. Yeah, we can see you. Don't worry. Yeah. I know a lot of you. If you keep kicking that camera, Kay, I will <laughs> take it off you. And I know a lot of you will have noticed I've got a different apron on. You can't Gl even see what it says. Greyhound friend it for says, life. Greyhound friends for life. So if you're wondering what it says, well, you can't even see it. But yeah, well, I can't. See can we just take a moment? I really hope that this isn't dirt and that it is just like chipped and stuff. Because if this is, if this is dirt, this is horrendous looking. Like, look at the state of this. That looks like dirt. Is this a goddamn hoarder's house? Is this what we're doing? <laughs> it's filthy. Okay. So, yes, so you will have noticed I've not got that horrible gawky one on. I gave it away. You gave, you gave away oh, an apron? I'm not going to add it all in. I don't want it all to move a bit. Oh, dear. So it's freaking warm over far. here today, guys. Can you see? Yeah, you can see, can't you? It's not that hot today, but the lights here are making it a bit warm. Put a tablespoon in and mix it round. Oh, dear. It's not coming together, is it? 
Like I said, I know it needed a lot more than three tablespoons. I mean, you're going to get your so hands in there, Kay, maybe? I'm going to get some more. I'm going to fill it up again. A little dish of water. How about, and, you, uh, how about you get your hands in there in. instead of trying to stir it with a spoon? Because the heat from your hands will help see. melt the butter. Oh, <laughs> what a bit too much, wasn't it? Oh. This come together. I'm adding some more water. Use your hands. Get in there and give it a oh, squeezy see. squeeze. No, you didn't need any more water. No. No more water. No, I'm gonna have to get my hands in there. I'm tell that I'm I'm calling it right now. That oh, dough is too dough. sticky. <laughs> that looks that like a sticky flour. nightmare. As you can see, I've got it out to the dish bowl, whatever you want to call it. Hold on a minute. Come on, get working. Come on. What? Get on that pastry and get moving. That's it. Oh. Oh, dear. Oh, I need, think I need a bit more flour. What was that? Is, is she struggling? Maybe, oh, is she having trouble with her hands? Okay. Right, I'm going to go and pass it to her with her hands. She'll be fine. Hey, look, she <laughs> found her rolling pin, guys. Oh, I'm going to use this with the handle. Don't want it too thin. I don't want it too thick. So. Oops. Well, the good news there. is it's not sticking to the board. Oh. So that's good. I think I should have put a bit more ingredients in. Should you? Don't do that. What? You okay, Kay? You okay, buddy? Right. <laughs> if you wonder what's catching on, <laughs> it's me phone in my pocket. Whoa. Oh, what is that on there? Did you just get dirt on your dough? What is happening? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Let me take my phone out of my pocket if it doesn't end up broken. That's it. I mean, I think the phone should be the least of your worries right now, Kay. Can you see what I'm doing? I'm doing I'm just rolling it out. Because I am going to cut the joint. Because uh, the video I watched, the man, he cut his joint. So I'm going to cut mine now. Oh, he cut his and joint, so you the, so you'll cut your joint, done. will you, Kay? And I'm going to put the. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, it's still running pink. Kay, it's okay. You're going to oh, bake it. Pink Kay, you still Don't have you to cook the... it. Don't fucking worry about it. It's going back in the oven. Please. Which one's in the middle? Please stop killing the meat. Man. I am fucking begging you, begging you, Kay. Please. <laughs> Would that be enough? Because I've needed some for the top. So, uh, ah, I suppose I'm gonna have to put this pink. Kay. Oh, I don't like pink meat. Kay, it's like going back in the like oven. She didn't trust the recipe because she pre-cooked the meat. Pretty sure you're not supposed to use pre-cooked meat in a Wellington. Where's my brush? Oh. I think it might be a bit big, that. How is she going to turn all that dough into the wrap for the Wellington? You know what he did? Took the egg. 
Well, good news. She's not glazing it the way she glazed the sausage roll and just dumping it all on there. So that's a start. <laughs> Round the outside. Two trailer park girls go round the outside. Round the outside. Round the outside. To the edge of this swamp. Because I think it's a bit too small. But it doesn't really matter. The biggest thing for beef I could get. There we are. A beef wellington. Is it a beef wellington? I don't know. Let it cook. And it does say to put it in for 15 minutes. But the thing is, my meat's still pink. And I don't like pink meat. So, I'm going to do no. a little longer. I don't know. It says 15 to 20 minutes. I might want to go in 25, 30 minutes. Oh. Put a hole in it. Oh, God, look at it. It'd be a lot, bigger than, a lot bigger than mine. Look at it. Oh, it's not even... No, don't add any more fucking egg, Kay. That's not your problem. Right, anyway. So that's going in the oven. Like I said, he said 20... 25 minutes. He didn't. He said 15 to 20 minutes. Mine. I will check it on 20 minutes, but I'm not going to enjoy the meat because I don't like pink meat. I've never fed pink Okay, before. it's going I back in for 20 minutes. That meat is going to be cooked. A bit cremated. A, a yeah, bit cremated? A bit cremated? Yeah, Wait, are you cutting it with a spoon? Can we see? Can we see it cut? Are you going to show us the cut yeah, product? Is it? And I made it with butter. And lard. it's it's really dry because oh, you cooked the bit. meat beforehand. Oh, so much bacon, I guess. Here we go. Um, the meat, bit of meat, I can chunk. Nice and tender. Oh, is it tender? Thank goodness. Mm. Nice and tender. But, yeah, the pastry. No, that meat is cooked onion. to fuck. Probably need a bit more the meat I'm just get a bit of meat out. Can we see it? Can we see the cut version? Mm. I don't want to see that's Lee's that's face. That's I want to see the it. food. Actually, strangely, strangely enough, it's not actually that dry. Mm, very good. Very good. That, as Lee said, the pastry was dry, and I can't understand it because last time I made it with butter, it was nice. I liked it. Uh, so, if you, if you, so there's going to be a link in the description to my merchandise. If you like what you see, yeah, you, you too can me. buy. To uh, I, we showed a uh, welcome back, Jamaica. We did, we did uh, show you guys Kay's merch at one point. It is literally just white merch with the words Kay's cooking across everything. Whoever else subscribe, get subscribing. Thank you. Bye. Oh, Christ. Well, that was an interesting way to make a fucking Wellington. Um, oh, God, her rice. Also, I love how the description for that one just says no merchandise. <laughs> just says no merchandise that is that is a brilliant advertisement Kay. good job oh god her Cor this says korean meal and it is literally just is that pork welcome back welcome back i think everyone's going to sleepy town uh, sleepy town or otherwise indisposed. 
I mean, it looks, yeah, uh, I have to click this. It's only six minutes. We might make this the last one. Um, because I imagine most of y'all need to go get some sleep, depending on time zones. Uh, I'm just intrigued by what her version of Korean is. Because I wonder if it's going to be anything like her version of Mexican food. Um, before we start... Before we start this one, while I'm waiting for it to, uh... oh my god, I did not hit play I'm on going you. To be doing a Korean meal, uh, and it was I did not hit play on you, I swear to god. YouTube is very broken. It just, she just blew out my eardrums with that high people. Oh... Uh... Before we start this one, I'm for one last time going to plug our subathon that we currently have running. It'll continue to run uh, after this stream as well. So if you can't sub now, feel free to return and and give some subs. Uh, you know, in the future, you can just go to the channel and do that. Uh, when we get to a hundred subs, and you know, we're only a forty odd subs away from that right now. Badger has to eat garlic. So, oh, YouTube has been broken, but see, I have premium, so I'm not, maybe I should just disable ad block on the page though, actually, because I have premium, so it's just really bad. Oh, all right, hang on, let me just... How do I... No, I just want to disable you on this page. Why won't you let me disable on this page? Ah, screw it. I'll deal with it later. You will make sure of it, Drameka. <laughs> uh, yeah, so at 100 subs, he has to eat garlic. You guys are doing really well, like... Like I said, we're only 40-odd subs away from that. I think at some point we're going to have to make it fair and I'm going to have to do something for subs because right now I just feel like we're kind of just being mean to Badgie and Badgie alone. <laughs> so if there's anything you guys uh, want to see me do for subs, perhaps we can think about another sub goal after um, this one. No, you just want to keep bullying Badger? <laughs> he might. Sorry. Told to me, it told me by a Korean woman how to do this. A Korean woman told her how to do this recipe. <laughs> Oh, God. Also, she's still really loud. All right. Okay, so we got some chicken. What? Wait, what are you doing? Why are you doing it like that? Why didn't you just put it in a bowl and then put the oil in the chicken in a bowl? This seems wasteful. Why are you doing it? Or even just brushing it with oil. Like put a little bit of oil in a dish and brush the chicken that way. That seemed inefficient. Oh, that's true, Jamaica. I'll have a think. I kind of want to do some more themed streams maybe. Maybe I should get like, like a costume, a cooking stream. Yeah, we could do a cooking stream. I could uh, maybe I could dress up for y'all. Get get a get a fun little cosplay happening. Three. 
out. What is that a little bit of rice in yeah. the bottom? Okay, no, it's we've cut away from that rice. That didn't seem like enough rice. <gasps> she's using She's using fresh garlic. Oh, Badgie would be pleased with Kay. Badgie would be so happy right now. Not gonna um, not got a lot. Did you cut your Did you cut yourself again, Kay? Good night, little princess. Uh, good night. Good night, little. Good night. Have a good night. Thank you for coming. You're not proud of her chopping skills? No. I'm She just cut herself again by the look of it. So that's that's great. I'm just saying it's garlic. Wait, what do you mean she definitely did say garlic? Are you not sure that she said garlic? Did she not write the recipe down? Why are you chopping the garlic like that? Maybe you should just stick to minced garlic. Cut it, she says, cut it very fine. That's not... That's not fine. What are you doing? <laughs> oh... I'm going to take my glasses off. It's too hot. My glasses are fogging up. And then she said, put it in a pan. Oh. Ouch. Wait, what did you do now? How, how did you ouch yourself then? And then she said, how did you add some barbecue sauce? Oh. Barbecue sauce. This Korean lady told you to add barbecue Maybe sauce. Add quite a bit of. Is that barbecue, barbecue sauce? sauce? That's the wrong color. Is that tomato yeah. sauce? Warm it, but not overheat it. So I don't remember barbecue sauce I being that color. Like. I don't think that's uh, I don't I don't think that's barbecue sauce, guys. Right, I don't know if you can see, but I've put the rice on. Wait, what? Did you just Wait What? Oh, it is literally okay, yeah, so we were right. It I don't think I mean it looks the same colour. <laughs> but it's supposed to be barbecue sauce. I don't think it's barbecue sauce. Now I'm going to put the sauce on, she said. That chicken doesn't look right. What did she do to that chicken? Why does it look that texture? I... Oh god, that chicken is so dry. Oh my god. Just it just It's just a blob. She said put a blob on. Was this lady actually Korean? Okay. This is the end product of a Korean meal. At least don't come into different this is this is Korean food, guys. This this looks exactly like when I go to the Korean barbecue restaurant. Exactly the same. Authentic Korean experience. Yummy yummy. Rice is yeah. Mm -hmm. Steak is that the proper word? Steak. Steak. Pork steak. Pork steak, nice and tough. The garlic and oh, it's lovely sauce. Should we import them? Right, the garlic and I barbecue sauce. Right, big spice, eh? Oh, in really strong barbecue sauce. It must really be the spice. Garlic. Wait, it's really pork? Spicy. I thought it was chicken. But all together. Did she say chicken at the start or pork? Uh, really, really strong flavors. 
Well, no, it's everything. Well, it's not like you're not trying to steal your thing. Mm, I'll steal your So. Yeah. What? Why? Right, well, it's only a small Korean meal, but it's, it was... I was that, told what about it was... What about it was Korean? I was told to do it by a Korean lady. This Korean lady told me to do this. This is an authentic Korean meal. If you like what you see, please keep doing me. If you want to give me a big old thumbs up, please do. If you want to leave a comment on whether you want me to make something or not, because like I said, I'm getting down my stuff now, and now um, I've just got two A4 sheets of papers full of recipes. So now we're to, looking for some more. Oh, um, God. So She's on the hunt yeah, for more. I mean, this, this was five years ago, if but... If you haven't subscribed or you know someone who hasn't subscribed, get them subscribing and get subscribing yourself. Thank you. Bye. Oh, my God. She redid it. Well, we'll save that for next time. Um, I think it... We, we, we've, we're at three hours, ten minutes right now, guys. Uh, oh, no, cancel. God damn, no, stop it. Yeah, I think the three-hour mark's a good place to call it. Um, thank you guys for sticking around. I know it was a little bit different with just me here to entertain you guys, but uh, I, hope, uh, I hope you still had fun regardless, those that are still here. Um... <laughs> Drameka, thank you for gifting five subs. <laughs> Ever as generous as always, it, I see. Um, but yeah, I I wanted to do a stream this week, even without Badgie, because uh, I missed you guys, and I have fun going through this nightmare cooking with you guys um as i said earlier if you want more from me you can find all of my links on card uh i'm on twitter at critter speaks i'm on youtube at critter speaks uh i'm also on reddit at critter jitter uh thank you bex for posting my links Join the Patreon if you want. Uh, I guarantee that even at the even at the lowest sub level, you get access to the Discord. You get early access to uh, all my YouTube audios. You also get uh, the occasional free audio. I know the New Year's audio is free for everyone. It, at least it should be. Uh, the next highest sub gets. Uh, gets free uh, monthly audios that are exclusive to Patreon. Uh, and if you really want to splash out the highest tier, gets a personal 10-minute audio with tags and scenario of your choice. Uh, way cheaper than commissioning me for an audio. So that is always an option. Oh, I also have, I also have a coffee, Ko-Fi. Uh, I don't think that's on my card, but if you want a quick voice note from me, you can tip me on coffee and let me know what you want and I'll send you a quick little voice note. It can be anything. It can be silly. It can be fun. It can be sexy. Uh, throw me a tip and I'll throw you my voice. Uh, thank you all for watching. I'm going to go now, and I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. <laughs> Bye for now, guys.